Okay, so this is the little brother right here. His name is Devin. His name is Devin. He looked like a little badass, but Devin is going through some shit. Okay. Devin got a got a cocaine mama who don't pay him no mind. She too crazy to really pay him any mind. She really just real erratic and stuff. So she's really like, nah, she don't be paying him no attention. And his brother was really the only person that paid him attention. And he's really, really sad. Like, Devin is super sad right now because before his brother went off to jail, he had, so he dropped his brother off at the neighbor's house for his birthday. I don't know why every time I put my game in that mode, I be lagging, but that's fucking annoying. But anyways, yeah, he dropped him off at his neighbor's house, Miss Bertha, to stay. She's like, she's like an old lady that lives next door to them. She's very sweet to the boys, and she takes the boys in when they need it and feed them and get them clothes and stuff. Like, she's, she's that kind of neighbor. But he dropped him off over there because he was getting into some real gang shit. Like, he was having trouble paying the gang back. They money that they told him to push for the coke. So, he sent him over there to make sure he was going to be safe and fed and stuff. Because he was going to be, like, mostly out and about around town. He wasn't going to really be home. But he had, he was coming to see him every single day. But then, like, maybe he waited maybe two days. He was too busy getting butt. He was too busy getting butt and doing what he was doing. And he didn't make time to come see his brother. So, his brother was really, really upset with him. And when he came to see him, finally, he was like, it was the day that he got arrested, actually. The day that Adonis got arrested, he had tried to come... Oh, he was trying to come to his brother's house to let him know, like, I just got arrested. Like, my trial coming up. Like, I don't know if I'm going to be around for a couple of days. So, but the brother didn't want to come out and talk to him. He did not want to come out and talk to him. So, then he had to find out from his birthday that his brother... That her brother that his brother went to jail, basically. Well, he went to prison. He's in prison. He doesn't know how long. Nobody knows how long. Um, he couldn't afford a lawyer, so... This sad-ass music has really hurt my feelings because I was really sad when the daughters went to jail. I was not kidding. <laughs> I was literally about to cry. Because <laughs> I knew he was going to jail because we couldn't afford a lawyer, and we was really trying to get up the money. We was asking everybody for money because we had just had to pay the gang $15,000. We owed them $15,000 for the coke they gave us. And we didn't even push that much. So it was like, what the freak, man? We owed them $15,000. We got the $15,000 by selling another brick that we had. And we had gave them all our money. Then he sold his last brick without, like, not selling it to people. He just, like, sold his last brick fully. And that was only $8,000. And... I don't even know how much the cheapest lawyer was. So we couldn't afford it and he ended up going to prison. So, but he's doing well in prison. He's just fine. The people love him. He's loving the people. It's all fine and dandy in there. But Devin is not doing too well. He's very sad all the time. And then he's always sad too because he always feels like he's dumb. Like, I don't know where he got that from, but Devin just... He just keeps, he just feels like everybody is better than him. And he doesn't understand, like, why he can't be happy. And poor Devin. Like, I love Devin. I'm so sorry, baby. You gonna be somebody. And that's what Miss Bertha continues to tell him. Like, Miss Bertha, the neighbor, she really sees something in Devin. And she always tries to remind Devin, like, you gonna be somebody, baby. Just know that. Just know that you're going to be somebody. And all this stuff that you're going through right now, you're not going to be going through later. Like, that's how Miss Bertha is for him. She's like a, like a mom, the mom he never really had. Because his mom does not pay him any attention. Like, what the fuck is she doing right now? I'm about to say, she probably sniffing. No, she's just standing here being crazy. She need her little stuff, though. But, yeah. So, that's where we at with their little life, unfortunately. So, I'm so sorry for Devin. We love Devin, though. He dropped him off some cereal, though, before he left, well, before he went to jail. But Devin is hungry. I guess he's going to eat some Kraft Mac and Cheese that his brother left when he left. He could go to Miss... No, it's too late for him to go to Miss Bertha's house. I don't know why he back so late. I forgot what I was doing last night. Oh, I took him to the park. Look at his mama. Look at her. Look at her. Giselle. Look at her being crazy. 
I try to let her sniff her own stuff by herself. It's over here on the counter. So I try to let her do it by herself. They're trying to fix it, and I'm damn, how long do I gotta wait? They still trying to fix it? Yeah, it's sad, right? But it's okay because Devin's life is gonna get better. Well, it's gonna get worse before it gets better. I will say. I'm gonna be honest. Devin's life is gonna get way worse than it already is. But that's okay. Because it's gonna get better as he get older. Oh, look, he cursing. Devin, I can't even go in full the, like the tab mode because it'd be lagging. Poor Devin. Clean up, boo boo. He's just gonna go to bed because he know he got school in the morning. He keeps going to school even though he feels dumb. Because Miss Bertha be on him about that school. She keeps telling him you need to go to school and get your education. We'll probably visit Miss Bertha tomorrow. Um, we've been home for like two days. So Oh, okay. We got something for Adonis. Adonis is training out at the gym as usual. And one of the other inmates starts talking about his brother on the outside. I know they not talking about his brother, Devin. Oh, wait, no, not that. Okay. Talking about his brother on the outside. He mentions that said brother can hook Adonis up with some incredible prices on cocaine. And asks if he... We're going to call that salt. Okay. And asks if he wants to meet up with him on the outside. Adonis fears that he might owe this guy something if he accepts. We're going to accept the connection. The inmate lets Adonis know that his brother is a guy called Roy, who, what? What does that say? Oh, pedals and steroids. Adonis can evidently find this font. I shouldn't have put this in here. I can't fucking see. And I got glasses on. Adonis can evidently find Roy at a certain gym. And if he name drops the inmate's name, that should be enough to establish the connection. So he got a, co a, a salt hookup. And some more prison reputation. Good guy. Just say, uh uh. Yeah, every day I call, they keep saying 24 or 48 hours. It's my whole neighborhood. That's some bullshit. Devin, you getting attacked by these bats. I got to take that off. You bad, boo boo. Why you in your mama face? Ain't she watching Hocus Pocus? Oh, she's literally always watching Hocus Pocus. Like, every time I come in here, it's the song on. What you watching today? I seen this movie, I think. Come on, then. What's this movie? I don't know. On his little ass TV. Oh, he's terrified now. He's not going to go to sleep. That's cool. Just use the bathroom. It's already about to be 5 in the morning. Just brush your teeth. Get it together this morning, I guess. Mm-mm-mm. The man. Again, I be feeling so bad for a little man. Feel confident outside at night. I know you're not terrified of the dark. Bye, little man. You getting on my nerves now. He tired of the dark. You didn't, you didn't, you didn't satisfy your craving, crazy lady. Cinema sim. Watching a movie can't list all the movies, mistakes, plot holes. Girl, come over here and do your situation so you don't be crying. Cause I ain't got time for you. You always doing too much here apply you some lotion boo boo because you, you don't want to be asked stop cursing dang go on head over to miss uh bertha house this morning you know she got some breakfast for you she always do miss bertha always got him some breakfast always she always like you coming over for breakfast okay we love miss bertha yes we do Come on, little man. Let's go to Miss Bertha house. Get us some food. Look, he be happy to come over here. He be happy to go to Miss Bertha house and get him some food. Miss Bertha could cook. We gonna make it so Miss Bertha be selling plates. No cap. I got the tool module, but I don't know how to use it. Because I want to put down the little selling station down there. So Miss Bertha could go down there and sell her plates. But I want it to be like at the apartment. I want it to feel like, oh, she... She came over here to sell plate. Like y'all, like y'all come get y'all plate from back here. Like back here. That's what I'm talking about. Right here. I want to put like right here or like on the side of the apartment right here. 
I want to put like a little selling station so Miss Bertha can sell her place. Like that's gonna be lit. Y'all know how to work the damn tool mod. I need to figure that out. Knock on the door. Good morning, Miss Bertha. Hmm, tell Miss Bertha good morning. Say good. Uh oh, not mental health, baby. Oh my good morning. Uh oh, y'all rude. What my good morning? Uh oh. I gotta control her too so I can make her cook. Oh, she might have something in the fridge. To be honest, she always got something in there. We only been, we been here. Oh, yep, she do. She like, good morning, Miss Bertha. She like, what, boy? What you doing this morning? You about to get ready to go to school, right? Yes, Miss Bertha, I'm about to go to school. I promise. Oh. She like, go on there, get you something to eat. I know you hungry. All right, stop talking to Miss Bertha. Go get your food. Oh, you're not even hungry. You're going to be hungry today. Go get you that food, but don't be starting. Don't be starting with this, with this scared of the dog bullshit. Start with me. Miss Bertha, you need a cigarette? You look like you need one. Look at you. Let me be Miss Bertha, because I bet you she need a cigarette. You need a cigarette? Why you ain't have one? I'm going to say, get you a cigarette then, girl. We don't want her to be all upset. She be getting cranky when she ain't had a cigarette. This man, craving connection. He always craving some kind of connection. Uh-oh. My game's stuck. Show it. That's so annoying. And I'm telling you, it's no matter what you do, your game won't get stuck like this sometimes. I've taken all my minds out before and it still do it like... I have reset it my game like five different times, bro. This shit is just, it's just like that. That's what I'm assuming. It's just like that at this point. I got better exceptions in and sometimes it tells me stuff. Sometimes it don't. Sometimes it don't tell me it's a mod. Most of the time it just says like there was an error. There was a problem, but it never, it usually don't say it's a mod. For some reason, I don't know, but my game is stuck, so. We love that for me. We love when the game is broken. And this goes for a minute. It does, unfortunately. I don't know if anybody else is having these same issues, but it's a very, very, very annoying issue. I will say, I'm looking for my Vaseline because I need something on my lips. I do. ASAP, ASAP. Oh, here you go. Like, where is it? Oh my goodness, okay. <laughs> Look. I don't know what's going on, but this game be getting on my nerves sometimes. I will say, though, I've been falling more and more in love with my Sims game. With, um, as I'm creating different stories and things like that. There we go. I'll do your thing later. I can't do it right now. But as I've been creating my safe out, I've been falling more and more in love with the Sims. So I would definitely 100% recommend people making a safe out, like a personal safe out for yourself. Because you'll fall in love with it. Like you'll you'll definitely fall in love with your gameplay and your Sims more when you have worlds full of people that you came up with the stories for. You're not figuring out their stories. You're not like you made these people the way you wanted them to be type shit. So I think that is so cool and it's been fun it's it's been oh shit y'all it's been a good time over here so i would definitely recommend it is it a lot of work hell yeah doesn't take a lot of time hell yeah but you can take your time and do it as you go so like y'all see i'm playing in my save file but only certain worlds are done like i have em a lot of empty worlds i've only done willow creek oasis springs the evergreen harbor I'm still, I'm almost done with Barchester. I got two more lots, but there are no Sims in there. 
Um, so I still gotta do that. And Sam Ashuno has some Sims, but not a lot of Sims, and the lots are filled. But I'm doing it as I go with the stories because depending on what I need is what I'll put down and stuff for like lots. She got the close knit lifestyle. Okay. I'm like, he ain't gotta go to school yet. Oh, now you tired. Go on in and go to bed till time for you to go to school. You only got an hour. She got him a blow up bed in here because she know he be needing to sleep sometime. He might come back here at the school instead of going home so he can get a nice, good home cooked meal. Ooh, who are you? Oh, girl, you some ugly Sim I didn't make. See, those Sims that I get that I did not make, and I think they ugly, I'll click on them and delete them. But I think I made her. Yeah. Wait, did I, bitch? Who are you? Got a lot of booby. I don't think I made her. Mm -hmm. Oh, she an NPC. That's why. Okay, continue. Bitch, are you pregnant? Wait. Is she pregnant? Uh, no. Sorry. You're not going to be pregnant. You're an NPC. Stay that way. Bye. Have a good time. You can stop walking like that now. Baby, you're not pregnant no more. I helped you out. Look. There you go. There you go. Now you taking a picture of the trash? What you going to go snitch? Oh, she ain't shit. Oh, uh -uh, look. Look at the male lady. Oh, shit. The male lady. I'm just looking at the people down the street while the little boy sleep. Oh, damn. This is a nice little house. This is a good little hood house. No cap. If Evergreen Harbor had more lots, bro, it'd have been dope. I'm tired of them giving us these half-assed lots, though. Where they just, I mean, uh, worlds. Where they only giving us, like, a, maybe four or five lots. Like, dang, bro, where are the lots? What happened to the lots with these damn places and expansion packs? Like, we be ready for the world, but then y'all only giving us five lots. What the hell are we going to do with five lots? We out here trying to make stories. We need at least ten. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh, he got one of my, uh, he on drugs. He on some kind of drug. What you on? What you on, bro? I forgot. But he one of my homeless people. I got homeless people in here and shit. Oh, wait, I don't know you. You might have to get deleted. Mm -mm. This is what I do. I just be roaming the streets trying to see who these people are. Ooh. Ooh, yeah, you ain't nobody. You gotta go, boo boo. You just taking up space. Mm hmm. When you see him, delete him. It's a fine man right here, though. Who are you? I know I made you. Connor. Oh, yeah, you married to that redhead. Yes, sir. He part of the lock career. He fine as wine. I like him. Little boy, ain't time for you go to school. Hell no, nah, you missing school. Get your ass up, boy. I'm playing and stuff. Go to school. Look, he, he just... Boy, where you going with no shoes on? He acting up. He showing out for y'all. Plus, y'all, if y'all see his friends, I'm going to show y'all for real. This boy... I, for some reason, y'all, for some reason, <laughs> I make all my Sims the same. This is why I download other people's Sims, like, for real. So, literally, when I make my Sims, I get a Sim from somebody else, and I use their base to make my Sim, and this is why, and just to be clear, the Sims that I upload are not Sims that people have given me, or they are Sims that I have my brother always do the same thing, bro. I'm finna embarrass him right here on stream. Bro. If you don't learn my schedule, bro, and I'm embarrassing you on my stream. Because if you don't learn my schedule when I stream, bro, I'm going to beat you up. Because I don't understand why every time why every time you call me, I'm streaming. You know I told you Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday, bro. Oh my god, okay, I'll stream tomorrow. I mean, I mean, I'll call you, I mean, I, I could call you when I get done. 
I stream at four o'clock. Used to be in school. Okay. Okay, Deandra. All right. I love you. Okay. I love you. Bye. Damn, my brother just embarrassed me. <laughs> That's my little brother. No way. No way. He ain't do me like that. Oh, it was an ad. My bad. Little man going to school here. Let me um actually participate. But I need to figure out how to work this tool mod, y'all, for real. Uh uh, stop. Oh, his empathy trait went. Yeah. All right, let's figure out how to use this tool thing. This tool mod. Hmm. Tool mod Sims 4. <laughs> hey, Deontay. That's my brother. I was just on the phone with y'all. It's easy. Well, help me out. How do I even pull it up? Tool stays open. Huh? I would have to watch YouTube videos. I just want to know how to pull it up. Oh, shit. The phone. Adonis hanging out by the cells while at while all of a sudden he hears someone yell inspection. The M.A. who talked about his outside connection gives Adonis a flip phone and asks him to hide it for him. The inmate then goes on about how Adonis needs to do the right thing with regards to the previous conversation. Except, I think he's gonna be fine, y'all. Oh my god, he not fine, y'all. I fucked up. Shift click on the item first. Okay, hold on. Adonis takes the phone and runs off to his cell. There aren't a bunch of hiding places there, but Adonis tries to hide it between the mattress and wall. Only for the correctional officer to find it. They confiscate the phone and Adonis gets dragged off to solitary confinement. While they give him a lecture about time added to his sentence. His cellmates gets a newfound respect for his loyalty, however. Adonis, how long are you going to be in jail, man? This starting to piss me off. Would I have to go in build mode? Probably. Yeah, he ain't never getting out fucking with me, bro. I think I might have to go in build mode. Do I have to go in build mode in order to get it out? I don't know. I want this popcorn, but I also don't want it. I'm about to move it. I don't want it no more. Okay. And then she says, shift click. It ain't doing nothing. Oh, pick an object I want to move. I only got $4,000. I should be Miss Bertha. Okay, I got 4,909. If I need more, I'll just get more. All right, where are the little, where are the little buying stations at? That's already in the world, okay. So I don't have to be in build by mode. You can only move CC objects. Okay. Why is my build by mode like that? Oh, you can't move CC objects. Okay. But people be putting their trees out there and shit. That's how they be getting them, them like CC cars and stuff on the streets, though, right? Did they did they change that for that or something? Why my shit lagging, bro? Come on.
And on the thing from the home chef of so pack, can you can you um sell regular food on that thing or you can only sell what they give you with that that already comes in the world? Okay, okay, okay. Gotcha. Where is that little thing? Is that is that in the outside stuff? Seem like it might be in the outside stuff. I don't know where it's at, but we're gonna find it. I don't know why my shit taking so long right now. It's not even a lot of CC on this line or nothing, but it's just bro. What the fuck? Hello? Hello? put it down i could you can sell regular food on there like if you want to cook a recipe from cuba beauty sell it. okay 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 where is that thing now i gotta find it oh here it is how much is this oh it's only 500 dollars. okay let me put bb move objects on gonna what color do I want it mm. I want it to look like something she made herself that's cute oh we, we could call it something about granny something okay yeah and I kind of want to move it like over here or maybe back there so I could do it in this mode right like in live mode I think I can you said shift click move can I can I just click over here no I gotta do I gotta do coordinates I know you fucking lying I gotta do coordinates <laughs> You're about to get punched. <laughs> oh my god. Take your time. I'm not in a rush. Click exit. Okay. Do it again. Shift click. Cool. I know y'all stream is a little delayed, so that's why I'm just in here. No, no, no. Okay, I'm gonna let you tell me what to do while well, I put my popcorn back in his bag. Right now, I just have it on. Toggle active object. Okay. Okay. Now what? Yeah, really. I'm ready. I feel like I gotta hit it at some point today. Ow! I'm gonna fix my pillow back here. My back is killing me. I clicked the space you wanted to go. Okay, okay. Hey! Now what? 
Should I click it again? Oh. Okay. Oh, now what? Hit the toggle active object again? I'm assuming. I'm assuming, right? No, just click it. Oh, just click it regularly. Hey! I'm so excited. Now I gotta play as Miss Bertha. I'm gonna play as Miss Bertha as the little boy come home. I got to. Right. Thank you so much, lovely Simmer. Now me getting a tool lesson. <laughs> hey yo, I'm forever gonna use that shit. Yes, I'm so turned. Yeah, we gonna play Miss Bertha after the boy come home, cause I, I at this point I'm tired of him not being in jail, bro. He's starting to get on my nerves. Why are you in jail? <laughs> <laughs> that took forever. It's... Thank you so much. Come on, little man. Get your son out of school. Miss Bertha, what you want to do? Not the drug dealer called her. Well, he wanted to see if he needed some more. He know, he going to get beat up when uh Adonis got out of jail and realized that his mama used the money to get the stuff that she wanted and stuff. And he going to be mad because his friend sold it to him. Yeah, it's gonna be serious. He has seven thousand dollars still left when he left, and we're gonna try to make her use all that. Raise her up. Uh, uh the little girl like, is Devin home? And this lady just being crazy. Look, girl, get away from my door. <laughs> Yellow. <laughs> I was just tripping out, but just watching because I'm lazy. Oh my god, hey. <laughs> Damn, hey girl. You always do that shit. Every time you see me streaming, you be like, nah, I ain't streaming no more. I haven't even watched the gameplay trailer yet. Oh, we just watched, girl, you missed it. We watched the, we watched both trailers and I went on a whole Sims 4 rant, girl. It was a whole situation earlier in the stream. We damn sure did, we watched it together. <laughs> um, Give her a rude introduction. Go out there and get a little girl a room introduction with your flip flops tone. Little girl, you got some money? Huh? 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 You got some money? Huh? Coming right here, asking about my son. Wait, what you, you got some money? <laughs> it come right back, because I'm kind of excited, low key. Yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. Uh uh. Devin gonna come running up here like, Ma, what the fuck is wrong with you? What do you mean? Where your mama at? Yell at her. The little girl just wanted to see Devin down. Get on. Mom, why you do that? Get just go in the house, bro. Throwing everything. Right, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Go in there and sniff some more coke or something, girl. Leave that little boy alone. Cause you just don't want too much. You making him upset. Go in there and do what you do best. Stay out of the fucking way. Damn, she's so annoying. Oh, apologize to the little girl. Look how she's looking at him. Gianna might be his little crazy. I might gotta put that first crush mod back in my game. Cause him, look at him, Gianna. I know I'ma lag a little bit, but I gotta get a photo. Cause look at him and Gianna. Hey, they so cute. <laughs> him and Gianna so cute. And Gianna actually lives in an apartment in the apart the other apartment complex in uh Evergreen Harbor. She lived with her younger sister too, so they kind of got a little bit in common because her younger her mom basically left them and basically gave her away because well basically gave her away, but basically their mom um she'd have she picked her boyfriend over them basically. Their boyfriend was real rude to them and 
mean to them. I'm not going to say any like triggering things, but she was, he was mean and rude to them and he didn't want any children. So she said, go. Now the, the sister, her older sister is about to start college in the fall. She's going to start college in the fall. So she was like, fuck it. I'm going to just take my sister in. She got her own apartment. She had a two bedroom. So she turned her office into a bedroom for her little sister. And basically her mom was like, whatever, take her. So that's that. We'll play her mom's life at some point. At some point when I make her. Because I haven't made her. But maybe y'all will be here when I do. Um, But I want him to kind of like apologize to her. A little bit. Just be like, I'm so sorry about my mom. just do tell the story yeah, i'm so sorry about my mom bro she's um different you know it's just it's a lot i'm sorry i apologize oh he's so cute You're like it's okay it's okay i get it you're gonna be like no you don't get it oh man i feel like he should be mean to her and just make her go away Just be like, what are you doing here, though? Like, why are you here? What's wrong? Oh, man. I'm gonna read a sentiment. Like, what are you doing here? Don't show up at my house, though. Like, seriously. Oh, let me control her. I feel like she's like a little sweet soul. I feel like she's seen how he was very standoffish and mean to himself. And just like, she would just want to be his friend. I feel like everybody else makes fun of him at school. And she just be trying to be nice to him. I think that's what I think that their thing is. I apologize. I'm sorry. I just wanted to make sure you were okay because yesterday you seemed upset. But I'm fine. You really need to get out of here though. Like seriously. Aww. Tell me you want to be his bestie. <laughs> that's my back. Wish you. Don't give him a hug. Like, look, it's okay. I'm here. I'm your friend, whether you like it or not. You're going to be mean to her again, though. <laughs> You're going to be mean to her. Yell at her. Tell you, hater. No, get out. Just go away, Gianna. She's like, okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Well, I'll see you later. Okay. You can come to my house anytime you want to play or something, too, if you want to. He just gonna walk in the house. He just gonna walk in the house. <laughs> he just gonna walk in the house and be like, bitch. I told you to get the fuck off my property. Like, he just gonna walk in the house. She's out there talking. So, okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Maybe, right? That nigga just said bye. Oh, Gianna. Gianna. He's, he's a little mean. He's a little mean, Gianna. I'm sorry, boo. Put that on my own. I'm good. Oh my good. I look high. I look good. Look at her. She's so cute. She's just like, mm, that's my friend. That's my friend. I feel like him and Gianna's story is going to go from them being friends to lovers, you know? Like when they get older, but he's going to like be so mean to her because he's going through shit. And it's just going to be like, bro. The little brother gonna just go ahead and pay for that to get fixed because we don't have nobody to fix that. Um, I'm going to let him go to bed or let him do whatever because I'm about to change to Miss uh, Bertha over there. I want to go to Miss Bertha. I'm back. I like the chair that the accent was so strong. Girl that's, what the f Girl, that's what I said. I said that same shit. I kid you not. I'm telling you, if you was here for my rant, we would have been here. But I swear I said that. I was like... I don't understand nothing this man was telling me. Like, you gotta put the captions on for that. Like, now I gotta rewatch it for a third time with the captions on. Cause I was like, why they do them? Like, why they put that man on there like that? We don't know what the hell he's talking about. Like I said, I'm not trying to be rude about his accent, but we don't like they should have made him do multiple takes or something to the point where we can understand or put the captions on there for us. Or something. Cause I, I didn't know what the fuck he was talking about. I still don't. I just had to interpret from what I was looking like. So now I got to go back and watch it with the captions on. Because I don't know what was going on. I feel you, though. 
Oh, the song I don't know. <laughs> okay. No, it's not just you, girl. It's not. But let's play as uh, Miss Bertha. But this is what I was talking about. This is where Gianna lives, where her older sister. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Our sister left at like 19, so that's why she looks so young. But uh, I mean, not 19, 18, sorry. And then next door is another brother and sister situation. Khalil was living on his own for a while, and his sister was about to go to college in Brightchester. I mean, in Foxbury, so she was like, can I just stay with you until I get ready to go on campus? So, yeah, she's going to school in the fall, too. So, they really, which is cool. But let's be Miss Bertha and start making some plates tonight so in the morning we can sell some plates because uh, Miss Bertha going to sell her plates. One thing about Miss Bertha, she, cause she can throw down in that kitchen. <laughs> See, this is also why I said that I like the fact that I made my own save file because then it makes me want to do rotational gameplay. Like, it makes me want to play with this family, that family, this family. Like, it's so fun now to do that because I created them myself. And these stories, some of these stories, I'm like, mm, I want to play that story. And before we get into Ms. Bertha, I'm going to tell y'all her story too. Um... I guess why she smoke her damn cigarette, cause we need to smoke. But um, so Miss Bertha, <clears throat> Miss Bertha is a a real ass old lady, and I'm 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 saying that like she's a real ass lady, okay. Miss Bertha don't play no games, okay. Miss Bertha say what she feel, when she feel it, how she feel it. Miss Bertha gonna tell you. But Miss Bertha, all in all, is a very sweet lady. And she loves to help out the community and the children in the community. She doesn't like to leave the children hanging. She'll give them a meal if they need it. She'll give them a place to sleep if they need it. Like, she, she did live that. She did. She did. <laughs> but Miss Bertha, she's so kind to the children. Like, she, she wants all the children in her community to do better. Like, she, don't, she sees all the gang violence and the gangs and the drugs. And she just wants... To help whatever kids don't want to go through that, you know? So, Miss Bertha is really a sweet lady, but Miss Bertha also has a daughter of her own. But her daughter is a stuck up bitch, straight up. Her daughter is stuck up. Her daughter is a lawyer, and so is her husband. They're both lawyers. Now, Miss Bertha has not, and they have a grand, and she has a daughter. I mean, a son. The ba her, Damn, get it together. Her daughter has a baby as well. She has a son, but Miss Bertha hasn't even been able to meet her grandbaby because the mama keeps saying she don't have time she don't have time to be coming over there and bringing the baby over there she lives in oasis springs so yeah i don't know she still loves her daughter you know she calls her daughter every single day and tries to speak to her daughter every single day in the morning but you know her daughter is who she is and she's just like you know that's still my baby I still love her, whatever the case may be. Yeah. Sure, Miss Bertha. But that's Miss Bertha's story. Her husband died, so, you know, he did and gone. He had to go. But he died, like, a long time ago. So, you know, Miss Bertha been over that shit. You feel me? We gonna have her make some some good food. So she gonna make some fried green tomatoes. Y'all, I had those for the first time. I've actually never had those before. And I had those for the first time, like, I think it was last month or the month before, something like that. It was so good. And they had some, like, sweet, spicy sauce. What kind of sauce with it? That shit was good. I ain't never know I was going to like some fried tomatoes because I don't like tomatoes. But I guess anything fried is good, you know, when you fat. Because, yeah, bro. That shit was tasty. This the man that's, he owns the gym in willow creek there it is and he a bouncer that nigga just got jobs <laughs> he just got jobs with his balls so you make them fried greens i wish they would have had a pot animation where she was throwing them in the grease or something that'd have been lit that would have been real lit i ain't gonna lie let me help her hunger because i don't want her to be eating this food don't eat shit we trying to sell it you gonna sell you some plates, girl. 
Okay, put that in the fridge. Let's see what else we want Miss Bertha to make. We want Miss Bertha in the soul food section only. Um, uh, Miss Bertha. Oh, we definitely making some fried chicken because you can't have a down south kitchen type shit going on with no fried chicken. And I must say fried chicken is so damn good. And I love fried chicken. I'm as black as they come. I love fried chicken and watermelon. I don't care. I sure do. I sure do. I am blacker than black. <laughs> and it's even better when it's together. I don't care. It really is. It's really good when you got fried chicken and watermelon together. I'm not kidding. Man, we call me blackity black, black, exactly. Call me blackity black, black, baby, because I love me some fried chicken and watermelon. Watermelon is actually my favorite fruit. <laughs> so, like, yeah. Uh -oh. Come on, then, with it, Miss Bertha. Not what's cooking good looking. We ain't giving you no damn food, girl. You just don't want no food. Get out of here. Ooh. What we making again? Fried chicken. Why she, why she rolling it up like that? Oh, shit. Look, <laughs> Look at the pie. It's my fave flavor like a candy and drinks with pineapple, my fave fruit. See, I'd rather a pineapple flavor of something. I do not like watermelon flavor stuff. It's not that good to me. But I don't like watermelon. Don't come for me. No, you good. You good. You ain't got to like it. You ain't got to like it. It ain't for everybody, you know. I just know that people say that people who like watermelon, like watermelon is a black fruit and, you know, fried chicken is like a black meal. So nah, I'm black and black, black for real. Cause I love them both. <laughs> All right, Miss Bertha, what else you gonna make? Ooh, make some chicken and sausage gumbo. Mm-hmm. You get down, Miss Bertha. You be getting down, girl. What's wrong? Oh. Uh, absolutely not. I don't know what that song was, but we not playing like that. Ah, <laughs> uh, no, for real, we not playing like that. But I am black, be black, black. <laughs> I understand. I understand. You still black, girl. Get down, Miss Bertha. Miss Bertha getting down, y'all. In this kitchen. She like, uh-huh. Made me some money tomorrow. I am good. Uh look at them. Ooh, Miss Bertha. Let me see the pot. Let me see the pot. Yes. Yeah, so, see, this is what I'm saying. They should have did this pot for the uh for the fried chicken and for the um the fried green tomatoes. Had them floating in there, cuz. Mm, you get it, Miss Bertha. She in the kitchen. And she whipping, hey! Season in the chicken, hey! Get it, Miss Bertha, finger licking, hey! Let me stop messing with Miss Bertha. <laughs> Ooh, look at that gumbo. That look good, that look good. Mm-hmm, okay, we made some food. Let's make some pastries. Oh, you ain't no baker, are you, Miss Bertha? Let's give you a southern pie. Southern pecan pie, Miss Bertha. And does this uh little thing, does it sell plates or do it only sell like, I mean, do it sell the whole thing as a whole? This is going to be fun. Now that this is over here, oh, this finna be fun. She gonna be over here. It's like the backyard, backyard cooking this bitch. Who you and why you got the whole nine on? I'm dead. It made this nigga the whole this nigga whole body disappear. Bye, bro. You're leaving my game, bro. Are you somebody? Let me see. Do I need you? Hell no. Where is that? I'm about to say, he gotta go. This the the lady that other man date. Mm -hmm. Oh, Miss Bertha need a cigarette, y'all. All right, after you make your pie, you can get you a cigarette, Miss Bertha. I'm sorry.
Oh, good. You streaming tomorrow? That means I'm gonna have something to watch. What time are you streaming tomorrow? Like later on in the day? Yeah, you got. Yeah, you got work. You be doing them early morning streams in the, on the weekend, girl. I be trying to catch them, but by the time I get up, girl, you be damn about to get off. I be like, damn. Why you doing me like that? I be trying to watch. I do. You be leaving me. Ooh, look at that pie. All right, Miss Bertha, come on. Ooh, that mean I could buy Miss Bertha a chair and sit it out here. Oh, shit, y'all. Nah, Miss Bertha, we about to buy you a chair. A nice rocking chair for you to sit on you. I be bored and trying to get my day started. I understand. About to get Miss Bertha this rocking chair to sit out there with. Yes, ma'am. We're gonna get her. You want a blue one? Mm hmm. That one look real old. Oh, that's cool. I'm gonna give her a little nightstand on the side of it. Yeah, something like this. There we go. It match. I want her to have a little... Because she seemed to like music, so let me get her a little something, something. Look at this little radio. That's cute. I'm trying to buy... I want to buy her a fancier one that so we can say like her daughter bought it for her. I just knew that was gonna be small, and it damn sure wasn't. Um, I don't know if this works, but I don't want to put nothing too expensive out there. Not that I got a jukebox to it, damn. This birthday ain't gonna be able to figure that shit out. The iPhone dock station. We'll just put this on there. All right, and I'm gonna move all of this out here. All right, she said shift click, tool, toggle, active, object. Can I turn it? Oh, I would have to use that, that little rotate feature thing, wouldn't I? Probably. Let me see. Too bad. Oh, shit. Move it over. Oh, she ain't gonna be able to get to her damn mailbox, my dumb ass. All right, that works. And then I'm gonna put her little table, her little table right next to it with her speaker. Oh, cool. That girl don't talk me something now, it's over. It's over. Oh, and it still got the thing on it. Oh, Miss, oh, Miss Bertha finna be jamming. Miss Bertha finna be out here smoking her cigarette, jamming. Come on, Miss Bertha, and smoke your cig. Oh, well, go pee before you come out here and chill out. Yeah. My bad. And then you're gonna sit out here and smoke your nice little cigarette. We're going to turn on her little tunes. I got my music off in the game, but y'all feel it. You get it, Miss Bertha. <laughs> I love her. I don't, I really do. This a vibe. This too much, y'all. That too much eat. That's two of my E. Oh my gosh, she can sit out on her porch with her cigarette and watch her. It look like she watching over the balcony, looking, you know. 
gas, Miss Bertha. Get your feels. Get your feels. Your vibes. <laughs> I'm just gonna have several pictures of Miss Bertha smoking a cigarette. <laughs> it's still so funny to me. You know, the old folks love to sit. Be nosy on that point. Exactly. Exactly. They really do. Early with it. And Miss Bertha be up early because she normally makes a plate or makes some food for the boy next door. So, Miss Bertha, not you out here getting down. Hey, hey. I want to see Miss Bertha do this cowpoke dance. I hate this dance, but I got to see her do it. Yeah. 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 Two step with it. Yeah. Hey, get it, Miss Bertha. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, wait. Wait, Miss Bertha. It got crazy. Wait, Miss. Wait, Miss. Okay. Wait a minute. All right, that's enough. That's enough. You're gonna break a fucking hip. That's enough. Relax, Miss Bertha. You're done. You're done. She fucking that shit up. Yeah, you're going to be your body gonna hurt in the morning. I just feel it in my spirit. Miss Bertha is a Capricorn, y'all. I don't know too many Capricorns though, so. How many how many meals did we have? I don't want to run out of food down there, you know. I got one, two, three, four. She only got four. Oh no, we gotta make another one. Oh, she up early this morning. You need another cigarette already? Yes, yeah, she do. Here, come on. Uh, turn that off. You don't need the music this morning. Come on out here, smoke your little cigarette. In your robe. Mm-hmm. We could be bossy and stubborn, but real and genuine and a bit cold-hearted, but loyal. Yeah, that's Miss Depp. That's literally Miss Bertha. That's literally Miss Bertha. She be giving that little boy tough love, but she knows she loves him. The little boy that she be taking care of every now and again. I guess he's not coming over today. That's cool. We can chill and get Miss Bertha um together. This morning. Yeah, empty this and get your coffee and you can sit out there too. Get your coffee. Come on, Miss Bertha. Girl, you do not want a child. How many times I gotta tell you you ain't doing that? And I wish that dumb shit would stop coming up too. I just I don't appreciate that. Miss Bertha gotta eat this morning, but I guess she gonna drink coffee this morning. Empty that. Okay. Brew you a nice cup of coffee. Miss Bertha says she don't need all that fancy contraptions and stuff. She want a simple coffee maker. <laughs> She's not playing. I love her. I can't wait till we can get back to the game gameplay, I swear. I really miss the game, but Adonis won't get out of jail, man. And I made him go longer, so I don't know how many days it's going to be before he get out of jail. No, come out here. Come out here. Come on, come on out here, lady. Thank you. Take your coffee with you. Come on. Oh, it's love day. Call your daughter this morning. Out here, get your ass back out here, Miss Bertha, and call your damn daughter and wish her a happy love day. Good morning, sweetie. Mama just wanted to say, oh, shit, she hung up on you. She's like, oh, okay, she gonna hang up on me like that. I know you fucking lying. All right, well, time to get started with my day. Shit. Her daughter really hung up on her. I know you fucking lying. She, I, I can't believe she really did that to her. Y'all, I'm not even kidding. All right, I want her to do one more, another soul food. Fried cabbage. Do a green bean casserole. 
Yeah, do a green bean casserole. We got to get Miss Bertha some friends, too. Yeah, we got to go out and make her some friends. She got to go outside. Oh, Lord, she got a limp leg from exercise. And I told her ass to sit the fuck down somewhere. I dang sure did. It was that cow poke. Didn't I tell y'all she was going to be hurting today? Didn't I tell y'all she was going to be hurting today? I said, Miss Bertha going to be hurting from doing that cow poke dance. Miss Bertha, what are you doing? You were supposed to be cooking. Okay, use the restroom, Miss Bertha. Come on. And then you got to resume your green bean casserole. We got to go out there and sell some plates today. We're going to do it at 12. And we got to get this juice and stuff out your inventory because you don't know how to act. And the ice cream and stuff. She must have ate the other ice cream already. She bought that juice for the little boy, but he didn't come back. Yep, make that green bean casserole. What's your problem? Damn, girl. Your smoking addiction is becoming a problem for real. Did you just sneeze in that, Miss Birth? That's nasty. She sneezed all in that. And then you're going to give it to people. You nasty. Like, for real. Come on here so you can smoke another cigarette because this is becoming too much for me. Oh, look at her leg. Oh, Lord, Miss Bertha. Yeah, come take a muscle relaxing bath and then you can smoke a cigarette. Oh, there he go. Oh, he going to school. Oh, um, he always looks so sad. Oh, man. Who are you? Oh. I know you. You was that lady that was pregnant that I, I killed your baby. I'm sorry. Your baby had to go. Yeah, have a muscle relaxing bath. Miss Bertha! Girl, you falling asleep in the tub? I know you lying. She gonna fuck around and die. Yeah, Miss Bertha. 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 Please, please. We need you. We need you. All right, come on. Because you got to smoke your cigarette anyway. What time I said we was going to do do the 12? I said 12. We almost there. They got a lot of cigarettes in this bag too, though. So I got a two. Yeah. Oh, Lord. Look at her leg, bro. It's the leg cross for me. Well, who you see? Who that is? Who's that? Agatha. You want to be friends with Agatha Crumble Bottom? Maybe that'll be her bestie. Wait, Agatha. Wait, don't go nowhere. Oh, that bitch. She don't want a friend. Oh, she's a bitch. Oh, where'd she go? She coming back? Is she coming back? I don't know. Oh, girl. Oh, don't go be friends with this man. Don't do that. He got a wife and she don't play. Well, that's T. Come on, Miss Bertha. Where the man at? I said that's T. Come on, Miss Bertha. Bonnie Simmer. Oh, my God. Hi. How are you? Oh. Let me give everybody their shout outs. My bad, y'all. The implicity. I hope I spelled that right well. It won't come up. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Shout out to them. Y'all make sure. Uh uh. That's the video that comes up. Oh. Oh. Wait a minute. <laughs> I'm dying. And then let me give the bonus in my hers. How are you, girl? I'm crying. <laughs> Oh, man. I'm good. No problem. I had a, I thought the bonnet simmer shit was going to be wild. I be watching your streams, bro. You so funny. I do be watching your streams. I'm not going to lie. Um, well, right now I'm playing with the next door neighbor, Miss Bertha. Uh, she's just a, a lonely old lady. <laughs> 
who helps out the next door neighbor's kids um because their mom is a co-kid so um so you know she be helping the little boy out and his brother is in jail now in prison now and he got a longer sentence because i fucked up so yeah bless bless the little boy heart so she just be there for the little boy and she tells him that she believes in him and stuff and hopefully he believes her one day and becomes somebody but i feel like he's he's gonna not i feel like he's gonna go down a really 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 rough patch um but it's gonna be all right and it's gonna happen rather quickly considering the fact that he's in prison all year now and his mom been using up all his money that he saved up so that when he got out of jail, he was going to be able to, like... He been trying to save up money for him and his brother to get food and stuff and move out. And the mama going to use up all his money while he in, in jail. And then he going to find out that his homie that he in the gang with is selling his mama more coke after he told him not to. Yeah, it's going to be crazy. But, you know, Miss Bertha is over here. We're playing with Miss Bertha because Miss Bertha about to go sell some plates over here. Oh, it's 12 o'clock. Damn, Miss Bertha, we can't even talk to that man. Maybe we'll see him one day. Um, We got we to gotta cook, though. Ms. I mean, we got to go sell our plates, Miss Bertha. Yeah, it's a whole situation. It's a whole situation. But it's okay. Little man going to be all right. He going to make it through at some point. Let's get all her food that she's trying to sell. Uh-huh, uh-huh, Miss Bertha. Come on down here. You smoked your cigarette? Okay, she did. Okay, come on down here. Girl, you weren't even at my house. Shut up. All right, and let's put the plates and stuff in there. I know there's not enough food, but I don't care. We're just going to put it in there. We're going to sell what we can sell. Let's sell these plates. Oh, tend this. Tend the table. Yeah, stock it and it's tended. It. Come on, girl. Oh, I forgot she got this limp leg. I told you to stop doing that cowpo dance. You started doing all that jumping, Miss Bertha. I told you. Now look at you. I told her, y'all. I told her don't do this. <laughs> Did I not? Did I not tell her don't be doing all that? Well, now she limping. Ooh, the rats. Ooh, the rats. Stock that table, girl. Oh, we could have made a lot more food. Okay. I, I never played with this, so I just wanted to see. Oh, the people is coming. Oh, Kiara. Kiara lived down the street, actually. So she coming to get a plate? You coming to get a plate? Were you? Is she tending the table? Okay. She don't need me to tell her to tend the table then. Oh, you coming over here? You should. Make you cheat on your wife. <laughs> no, he should, though, for real. Why she turned this way? She in pain. We gotta get her some painkillers. Y'all don't want her food? She good. She a good cook. Oh. Y'all better come over here and get me some of Miss Bertha food. Can we talk to the people? Oh, we can. Ooh, give a sales pitch. But we have to move? What's going on, y'all? I don't know how to play with this. I'm trying to see. If I stop her tending the table, oh, she can stop tending the table. No, talk to the man. Oh, he's leaving. Oh, come here. Damn, it's gonna take her about 20 years to get over there. Hey, she lived down the street too. That's Gianna older sister right there. He right there. Girl, the people over there. Sierra, oh, your daughter wanna call now? Girl, I can't talk to you. Tend the table. Go back, girl, with your crippled ass. Oh, look, all the hood bitches out. <laughs> all the hood bitches out. All the hood bitches want to play. This is my hood bitch right here. Yeah, boy, she killed my dark skin self. I love her. I got to play her like she a hood bitch. For real. Um, convinced to buy. She look like she want to buy that. Um, you want some chicken? <laughs> You want some chicken, girl? Talk to her. Look at the twins. I love seeing my Sims out. Yes, girl. It's only thirty dollars. Oh my god. We got Kiara out here. Girl, you know you need some. Oh, they really do buy plates. 
<laughs> I'm so excited. Look how Miss Bertha looking at her. She's looking at her like, who is lagging again when I do it? I just want to take this picture. But she's looking at her like, is it good? You like that? I know you like that, girl. You better get you some chicken. Hey, yo, what are you doing, Miss Bertha? What happened to that? Don't be flirting with these people. Girl. All right. Uh-huh. Convince these people. Wait. Why I can't convince her? She must be leaving. All right. Hold on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. There's too many people. <laughs> like, ew, I sneezed in that. <laughs> Fact. Well, she didn't sneeze in the fried chicken. She sneezed in the green bean casserole. But she must wait to try again. Okay. Give a sales pitch then. Y'all want? Y'all know y'all want some of this good food. Girl, you can't afford shit, Giselle. Take your ass on. Giselle can't afford nothing. Bye, Giselle. Stop messing with these girls. Oh, oh, they getting it all. Oh, she bought the whole casserole. She bought the whole casserole. She bought a plate. Yes, girl. Oh, that girl said it's checking good. Yeah, I know it is, ain't it? It's eating, ain't it? Girl, get you some. Get you some, Mariah. Get you some. Mariah's a, uh, not that you like, mm, it look all right. Mariah, if you don't get you this damn plate, I thought so. Oh, what you buy? What she buy? She bought, a, oh, she bought some of the gumbo, okay. It's hilarious, cause she dead ass remind me of Felicia for Friday. Yeah, no, Giselle, Giselle ain't really got no money to be buying no plate. I don't know why she over here. Damn, Giselle, go home. Look at Elise. Elise up through here. She's actually the girlfriend to uh, the gang leader that um, Adonis is in. The gang that Adonis is in. Give her a sales pitch. Maybe she'll go for it. The whole neighborhood over here. I love this. This is giving so much realism. They coming heavy for the food, though. They damn sure is. Yes. I gotta sneeze. She like, oh, you need to give me the recipe to this girl. <laughs> oh, sorry, y'all. <coughs> oh wait, many. <coughs> sorry. <coughs> I don't know what was going on just then. What was that? Oh, you can't be hungry, Miss Bertha. You gotta wait. Here, smoke you a cigarette. Go here. Smoke you a cigarette real quick. And I'm gonna be right over here, y'all. Y'all make sure y'all get y'all play if y'all want to. Delete the money in the jaw. She watching though. Why y'all crying? What the fuck is going on? <laughs> Ain't nobody ate no fried green tomatoes yet. Y'all better get you one. Better get you some. There's some good food over here. There is some good food over here. Why can't I tend the table? Oh, well, when you smoke your cigarette, you can tend the table again. Look at you trying to get juice. It's birthday. Can you just eat? Oh, I'm about to say, can you just eat something off of here? Yeah, I'm finna put something in her inventory because she about to get on my nerves. Like, I get that you hungry, but come on, girl. We trying to sell these plates. Oh, we about to close up shop. It's 5 o'clock. Been out there for five hours. Hold on. Um, I'm going to put this in. Her oh, I can't. I can't. Oh, Miss Bertha, you just going to be hungry, boo. Oh, I can put this in there? Okay. We'll just grab you some candy. Grab you some candy, girl. That food was good one of y'all. This makes me so happy. I don't care. It really do. Oh, you better leave that girl alone. What, child? I've been thinking of getting it to know Karina. Sure, baby. Whatever you want to do, sweetie. All right, tend the table one last time before we get ready to get... Oh, come on, Miss Bertha. I know you're late, bro, but you got to move a little faster, baby. All right, come on, one all. We about to let this go. At six o'clock, it's about to be over. You ain't got a plate. You missed out today. Convince him to buy. 
convince him to buy these fried green tomatoes because ain't nobody bought it. I was talking to my husband and said, can you move quick because I'm hungry. Dad said, I get, I get that you hungry, but... <laughs> oh, my God. I'm sorry. That's funny. That is so funny. All right, the food sale is done. Sounds good to me. Oh. Okay, wait, how I get this? Um. Oh, clear the table. Hey, 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 limp leg, come on back. Yep, all right, you go home now. You can get you something to eat at the house. Just don't eat nothing right here, because we're we going to sell these tomorrow, too. We're going to make some fresh stuff, too. Oh, I like this. I like selling food. <laughs> what? I like the fact that we can sell, like, real food. Like, that's what's getting me. What's this? Well, that's spoiled. Mm, it's birthday. Why you got spoiled food in there? You got to cook you something to eat. Here, what you want? You want some chicken? <laughs> Whoever got the sag and pan definitely double cheeked up. <laughs> so that's that's uh the gang leader's right hand man, actually. That's funny. That's funny, because I said his booty was all out one day. I said that too. Make you some fried catfish and collards again. I thought she had to smoke again. I was supposed to say, come on. And then we're gonna order you some painkillers, okay? Cause I didn't know you had to. I didn't know you needed that. I got you, though. Well, we got you. You got yourself. You feel me? <laughs> you got yourself. Oh, it tell you the food sales? We made a 1000 We made 1600 We sold three fried chickens, two green bean casseroles, and one chicken and sausage gumbo. Yes. I love that. Oh, that made me so happy. Miss Bertha, we out here making moolah. All right. Is he going to get out of jail on Saturday? Because, like, <laughs> that's crazy. I need him to get out of jail on Saturday. Miss Bertha, what's... Oh, she got a pee. I'm like, what's her problem? All right. I'm going to go play the little boy. I got to make sure he's doing his homework, y'all. He'll fuck around and not do his homework. Damn, bro. She be needing like 20 million cigarettes. I ain't even lying. Damn, Miss Bertha, you be needing all the cigarettes. Man, take your ass in there and pee. She just pissed on herself. I'm done. Miss Bertha, I'm finna leave you. I'm finna leave you. I'm finna go back to the little boy because you acting up. You pissing on yourself and shit. <laughs> Damn. I didn't know she was going to do all of that. Here, come sit out here and smoke your cigarette. And then you're going to go to bed. It's already 10 o'clock, so I guess I won't be the little boy. Till later. I was going to go in a mail. Girl, let me stop. I'm going to stop. I ain't going to be that nosy. See, I can't wait till the new pack come out because I'm going to have nosy neighbors and everything. Show Liz. Call me when you need some. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. She's sleepy today. Look at her. That lint leg thing is serious for her. We didn't do nothing for love day. That's sad. I was trying to get her a man. Or trying to get her somebody she could sneak around with. But the man, the man wouldn't come over. Hey, we all up in her apartment. Hey, yo. <laughs> Okay, come on, Miss Bertha. You got this. She was tired, tired, y'all. She didn't get up before five. Damn, she getting up late today. Here's the use bathroom. You can brush your teeth this morning. Eat you a nice breakfast. Cause at 12, we're going right back out there. Now the baby, I mean the brother gotta be out of be out of jail at some point, man. You out of jail yet? Hell no. There's no way this is happening to me. Is the only way he get out of jail is if I'm playing in that household? Because that would suck. That would really suck if that's the case. And then when you get done eating, Miss Bertha, we got to cook some more stuff. Because 
Well, no, let's sell what we already got. Let's not even cook nothing else because they're not even eating what we putting out. I don't have time for them to play. Oh, she got to watch her show. What show you got to watch? Your cooking show, girl. You always watch somebody cooking. With your little ass TV. <laughs> oh, you got $50,000 in your TV still that little Miss Burton? She don't care. We got to go to the H&B &B store and get Miss Bertha a new TV for real. I mean the H&B store. Okay, come on. You got to do your morning cigarette this morning. <laughs> No, nah, she got to get that shit under control. Because she, I swear. I swear. Okay, let's turn your little morning tunes on. Let's see your blues this morning. Again, I know y'all can't hear the music for her. Oh, look at him. Why he all, look. Miss Bertha, like, you have a nice day, okay? You, you do good at school. Pick your head up, boy. You don't go to school like that. It's going to be all right. Oh, man. Devin, he be so sad. He miss his brother. Devin. I can't wait till he come back either, baby. Oh, shit, Miss Bertha, it's raining. Will her roof technically be over her? A little bit, but you need to get inside, Miss Bertha. Your cigarette gonna get put out. Oh, we can't sell food today. It's raining. Damn. All right. Well, I ain't finna be her today then. It's cool. Um, Empty this out and go ahead and get you uh, some coffee. When the little boy get out of school, then I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go back over there then. Because she can't sell no, sell no. What's her name today? Damn, Miss Bertha. Oh, we need to take Miss Bertha outside. That's what we gonna do. Take her outside after she drink her coffee. Take her ass somewhere. She probably don't want to go nowhere because it's raining. <laughs> like, for real. She probably don't. I gotta also put some more old people in my game. I don't have a lot of old people in my game. I really don't. I, I mean, I'm still not done with my save file, so it's still a lot of people I have to put in here. But she gotta get some friends. She definitely has... Oh, she created a social media profile. Look at you, girl. Youth activities. Family activities. You go by yourself. You go by yourself? You go by yourself, girl. Where you want to go? I can take you to the movies. Uh, ain't nothing she could really do. We're going to go start taking her to the church services on Sunday, though. Oh, the little boy not in school. It's Saturday. Oh, wait, there's a man outside my door. <laughs> <laughs> That's that man Judas. He probably like you still got plates. I know it's raining. Ooh, what you wanna do? <laughs> Using them as only sugar daddies too. Like if it's an elder, that's their main purpose in my game. I understand. She's like, hey, how you doing? It's her coming out here to rock in this chair. Yeah, excuse me, ma'am. I was just wondering. I seen you had plates yesterday. I know it's raining. She's like, baby, come on inside. Mm. Girl, girl, get you some. Better get you some, Miss. Mm -mm. <laughs> that man is a married man. He gonna, she gonna get him caught up in some shit. Miss Bertha says she been single for a long time. <laughs> Miss Bertha. Come here. Come on in here. Mm hmm. She's like, I got something for you. What you want? You want some casserole? Some chicken? I mean, like, I want some chicken. Okay, I got you, baby. I'm giving him some chicken, Miss Bertha. Hmm, just put it on the table. Let him come get it. I'll control him for a second. Let him come get it. Mm -hmm. She's like, go ahead and get you some. It's right there. He's like, oh, thank you so much. I'm sit down with him. She in her robe, though, y'all. I can't believe she in his robe. She's like, I'm sorry I'm all in my robe, baby. I was just having my morning smoke. What seems to be your problem? Oh, my God. We're going to try to console this grown-ass man we don't even know. <laughs> mm -hmm. She got to stop with this have a child shit, for real. Uh-uh, what's going on? Why? 
Uh, wait. Uh, did he just leave? Where he go? Sit your ass down. They both flirty though. Wait, ready for some action? What he got? Oh, he's scared. I thought he was flirty. Discuss the food. You like that chicken, baby? <laughs> Ew. Yes, ma'am. This is really good. Thank you so much. I haven't had no chicken like this in a minute. You, well, your wife don't cook? I mean, she cooks from time to time, you know. We just don't have time for that no more. Well, I got a lot of time to cook. Mm-mm. 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 Have a deep conversation with him. Oh, her daughter popped up. She like, Ma, you ain't answering my calls. You ain't called me back. Are you pregnant, bitch? I know you lying. You having another baby? Is that why you over here? Just tell me you having another baby? And I ain't see the first one? Miss Bertha gonna have to take a trip out to Oasis Springs and see her grandchildren. But she in here pregnant. She's like, hey baby, I'm glad you came over. I'm talking to this nice young man. <laughs> Ooh. And I'm with you. Just sit over here and, and, and watch watch some on the TV for now until until she done uh talking to this nice man. He gonna get ready to go though, cause he see that she got company. But I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try to uh to get her to flirt with him. I really am in just a second. Let me see. Let's 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 chit chat with him a little bit more. Let's ask him about his day. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It's gonna be all up in this man business trying to know him. Now we ain't gonna try to play with him right now. We're gonna we gonna we gonna get back to that. Another time. She's gonna invite him out for a drink or something. Miss Bertha. Miss Bertha used to get down back in the day, get down. <laughs> Ooh, when the oh, all that just canceled out. All right. Oh, let me some moment. You are so annoying. Body to body like you do. Mm. Tell them how you made that chicken, girl. Just take just take my advice on the chicken. And you know, come back and get you some next time, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You be like, thank you. He gonna give her some money too. For you know, letting him eat. <laughs> Fuck you. Okay. He likes compliments. That's nice. That's real nice. Let's let him give her some money or, you know, giving him a plate, even though she was, she really didn't want him to. Ooh. 500. Damn. I wish I had like $10, $30. Just give her $100. Give her a hundred dollars, bro. Can he put this in his inventory? No. Can she give it to him as a gift? Or she for the hundred dollars, she can just give him the whole plate of chicken. His wife gonna be mad at him, y'all. Look at the daughter. This stomach is everything. Her outfit is cute, though. I will say. Let's see if we can give him affection. Give me gift. Uh huh. Give him the chicken or some chicken, I guess. She's like, thank you. Uh, you did not have to give me no money for that. I promise, baby. He's like, no, I, I, you deserve that. Wait, are we not giving him the chicken? Get this man the damn chicken. <laughs> um, give, give, friendly give. Come on, give him the chicken. All right. She's like, hey, you can have this chicken too. You can have some, take some home with you, okay? You have a very nice day. Give some to your peoples. Tell them, make sure you come back, though, okay? Can we hug this man? We don't know him like that, do we? We don't know him enough to hug him, do we? I bet you we don't. Oh, yes, we do. Mm-hmm, give him a hug, Miss Bertha. All right, baby, I'll see you around, okay? Why they hug like that? 
Get out of here, sir. She got to talk to her daughter about this damn pregnancy now. Because the fuck? When did you get pregnant, girl? I know you and your husband newlyweds, but damn. Don't control him. Okay. Yeah, he about to go. Now we can talk to our daughter. Don't talk to him. Here, sit down on this couch, honey. We got to have a serious conversation. <laughs> Come on, sit down. Don't talk to him no more. He's done. We talking to our daughter, cause I don't understand. When did you get pregnant? So I'ma let her, I guess, reveal her pregnancy. What trimester you in? She had a big news with your mama. She about to give birth any minute. You just not coming over here? And we yelling at her. Cause why you just not coming over here? Say, like, mom, um, I'm pregnant. Uh, bitch, yeah, I see that shit. I see that. Argue with her. She's like, baby, you, you don't never come see me no more. She's like, mom, I came over here to tell you I was pregnant. You waited all the way till you was in your third trimester? She like, mom, but I, I, I was, this is the only time I could come through. This is not the only time you could have came through here. You know you could have came through here any other time of the goddamn on week. You be more going everywhere else you want to go. But okay, well, I didn't come here. I'm telling you now. So what you want me to do? Girl, who do you think you're talking to? Because I know you ain't talking to me. You always get like that. You just want me to do what you want me to do when you want me to do it. Look, girl, let me tell you something. You don't forget who the f you were talking to. But I'm going to remind you in a second you keep playing with me. And this is why I don't come out here. <laughs> Damn, they beefing, beefing. She's like, listen, I love you, but you need to come see your mother more. I'm getting old now. She's like, ugh, ma, whatever. Give your mama, give your mama some money to get a ticket out there, even though she got the money. I feel like she would just give her mama the money. Be like, look, I'm about to give birth soon. Just come out there, bring a tick, you know, you bring, you know, bring what you need, and uh, just come out there. But ask your mama to say hi to the baby first, because that's cute. Because <laughs> that's cute. Oh, she, ooh, yeah, she should ask her mom to accompany her to the birth. Will she actually call her if I'm not playing her? We're going to see. We're going to see. We're going to see. We're going to see. Do those things first. Are they beefing, y'all? What they got? Oh, she's hurt. My mama yelling at her. Well... So, like, mama, well, can you at least feel the baby? <laughs> yeah, I feel my grandbaby. I wonder if it's a boy or a girl. I really wonder. Oh, she got a piece. Not you got some nerve. Oh. Okay, kissing your daughter belly is a little too much. I ain't gonna lie, but it, it is what it is. And doing all of this is a little too much, but it's still cute. Oh. So, you gonna come to my birth, ma? If being there will make it easier for you, then count me in. Oh, that's sweet. They be beefing, but they be chilling at the same time. I wonder, do I have to play her for this? I slick want to switch to her. Ask her how pregnancy been so far. Oh, wait. Hello, baby, from saying hi. She fell in love with the longing to create a lasting memories with her grandchild. Oh. Miss Bertha, we gotta take a trip out there. Nice to ask me my third trimester. I'm happy that I'm going to have a child. Pregnancy has its good days and bad days, but overall, it's a beautiful experience. Yes, bitch. Yes, it is. Yeah, I, uh, yeah. She had to pee. That's a baby right there, Apollo. A baby named Apollo? No, that's a dog. Um, Brandon is her baby's name. Good job, baby. She's so cute. Oh my god. Where you going? Girl, that's how you hurt your leg the last time. Get your ass in here. We're going to have her give her mama a hug because she's going to get ready to go. She was just stopping by. but Oh, share baby pictures so she can see her grandchildren. I didn't even know you could do that. Look at that. The more you learn about the pack, bro. 
Oh, talk about healthy living. Be like, mom, we live a really pretty healthy lifestyle. So when you come down, don't be trying to cook all your, your fried chicken and stuff, okay? Oh, ask her for a loving hug. I didn't know you could do all of this. I'm learning new stuff every day. Reconcile argument. Be like, okay, I'm going to try to call more. I promise. But make sure you come out there and, and come see the children. Okay, I'm going to go. Wait, oh, we need to give her some money. Give her, give her, is that 10000 Damn. Just give her 5000 She don't need that much fucking money. Damn. Okay, in the bathroom? I right here, Ma. I'm going to give you some money, okay? I'm out there to see us, all right? I'm about to give birth real soon, so you need to come right out there. It's a nice house out there you can stay in. Or maybe, maybe we can have her stay at their house. Maybe I'll change to them. Look, you see how the stories just keep going and going and going? Like that's, that's, that's how you, that's how you do it with a save file. The stories just keep going, going, and going. They're never ending. Some people tie in together and stuff. Like that just, that's cool. All right. Um, I need to send her home. I'm trying to send her home. Okay, go home. And then. I'm going to actions. Don't control sin. Yeah. I'm going to send her home and then I'm about to switch with her. Switch to her so I could be there for her pregnancy. So her mama could be there and have the grandma mama experience and all that. I got to. I was going to get Miss Bertha to go take a trip out there, but I'm going to have her stay with them because they got a lot of rooms. She got that cow poking again, y'all. This is what I'm saying. This is exactly why her fucking. Why you pregnant? Who you? Why you pregnant? Yeah, uh, y'all not creating no babies I didn't ask for. If unless I made you, absolutely not. Who you and what's your job? She a repair technician? Yeah. Yeah, baby, you can't handle babies. Sorry, you're there for strictly purposes that I need you there for. Sorry, have a good time, bang. <laughs> you 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 can you can stop walking like that, baby. Mhm. Mm All right, Miss Bertha, here I'm gonna have you smoke your cigarette real quick. Actually, no, nah, you chilling. You do your thing. I'm about to change to the daughter real quick. Cause she about to have her baby any at any moment right now. Like, and I'm ready. I'm ready for her to have her baby. Cause her man and her life is cute too. I've been living a rough life for a minute. I could live a nice a nice life for a second. <laughs> I could use a little niceness in my life for a second. <laughs> I definitely can. I love just chilling and playing my game. And my man not home and he's not gonna be home for a minute, y'all. So we really chilling. We we vibing, we chilling. Do they have a mm -mm, y'all not supposed to be in there? See, I'll be having to evict. See, I think when the houses are empty, I'm just going to make them rental lots because they keep doing shit like that where they just keep putting Sims in the house. So I think I'm just going to start making them rentals. Where is this family? Did I put a family there? Hmm. Sometimes these families be blending themselves and stuff. See, I don't be wanting all that. How you turn all that off? Because I want my families the way I want them unless I moved you in with somebody. Gameplay. Wants and fears. Please don't. Oh, well, I guess we can show wants and fears. Lifestyles. Disable autonomy. Autonomy for... Uh, it might not be a way for us to do it. NPC relationship was like disabled. NPCs will no longer develop relationships with other Sims autonomous. Yeah, I took it off. Self discovery, career layoffs. Yeah, I still haven't had a Sim be laid off yet. Okay. Um. All right, let me save my game because I have been just playing without saving, and nobody has reminded me because y'all don't love me. But that's cool. And I'm just. They got a baby too? Oh, shit.
They live here. My bad. <laughs> you good. I think they live here. This, they're like a business couple, kind of. But All right. I'm going to be the baby. Wait, where your man? Why was I only showing them two? If her man done went off somewhere and did some shit. <laughs> if her man went off and married some other girl or something, I swear for God. Like, where is he? Now I'm scared. Now I'm scared. Cause where did Joe, where did Joe, where, where the man go? Mm, yeah. It be getting serious over here. These Sims be doing shit you ain't even tell them to do. Cause, cause where, where is he? He better be in there when I get in there. I'm not kidding. I swear. Come on. Hey. I don't even know this song is playing, but it's a vibe. I ain't gonna lie. If you've been here for a minute while we waiting on this to load make sure y'all follow my uh i mean subscribe to my youtube channel i do all things sims over there and check out my tiktok where i do all of the behind the scenes content of being a full-time content creator if that's something that y'all interested in then make sure y'all follow me and subscribe to my youtube channel okay um just hiring any of them what a man Where is your... He died? What do you mean? When did he die and how did he die? I don't have that turned off. Nope. Nope, I will shut my game down right the f now. Where is he? How do I bring him back? Because no, I can't stand that. When they be doing dying of laughter and shit. Absolutely not. No, he's not dying like that. I'm not taking that. That's not his story. He got to die of cancer or something else. He cannot die of just, of just laughter. You a lie and the truth ain't in you. No, I'm gonna cry. That man was like the lover of her life. Wait, bitch, you ain't paid your bills. What's going on with you? I thought you been living a good life. You over here ain't got your bills paid. Got your baby up in here by herself. <laughs> that lady crazy. She is going insane because her husband dead. Girl, we your <laughs> husband. Wait. Can I bring him back? Why am I lagging? This is not the time. This girl is about to go through a whole pre pre she went through a whole pregnancy without him. He got her pregnant and died. Get the fuck out of here. How we get back? Okay, maybe our MC command sent him. Is he gonna come back? Oh. Yeah, come back, baby, please. Invite him over. <laughs> no way. She depressed. Fuck them bills. No. Yeah, I brought his ass back. I'm not. Uh-uh. He not dying like that. And I'm about to get that fixed, too, while we at it. May over here pregnant. This is my main Sam I was playing with. For real, for real. This is my little Asian Sam. She's so cute. <laughs> she blazing, actually. If you can't tell from the booty, but she she blazing. 
and she got a uh, a Hispanic husband. So they a Blasian Hispanic family. They have about to have three. Well, her nasty ass. She always fucking. She's always somewhere having sex with her husband. I'm not gonna lie. She loves that man. They love each other. They can't get enough of each other. I love their story. Because they can't get enough of each other. But it's to the point where I put this girl on birth control. And I made her husband get condoms. And they ain't really used them. But I made him get condoms. And she still got pregnant. He wanted that other, they both wanted another baby and I was trying to prevent it. I got them a dog and everything, y'all. Like, I don't know what their problem is, but anyways, yeah. Invite that man over, girl. And I think you got work. Is this, girl, that's not even the right career. What, did you have a career change? Did you decide you wasn't going to be a lawyer no more? What the fuck are you on? This whole household just went to shit. Like, what the fuck, girl? Uh-uh. I don't like that. Come on. Okay. Just just hit okay. I think I had her. Yeah, like a little paralegal. Okay, cool. Yeah, do that. I don't know what you on. Hey. Yeah, you. You can't die like that no more. No more. Add this man to this household. I don't with you. Add to the family. You was fucking around too. I, I'll leave you in the business great. I mean, y'all both supposed to be lawyers though, but I'm gonna leave you alone. It is what it is. This man really just dipped out on us. He was dead, dead, y'all. This is, <laughs> that's not funny. All right, let's, uh, <laughs> that's not funny. <laughs> let's go ahead and plan a stay over for the mom to come tomorrow. Cause today is already at five o'clock, 5 p.m. So we're going to have her come on through tomorrow. I'm going to have her stay for four nights. But if she start acting stupid, I'm just kidding. No, nah, but um, if the baby come before then, she can leave a little after that. I don't know, four nights. The baby should come in four nights. Is she in her third trimester? That baby really should. Yeah, the baby should be here by four nights for real. So she could come over. 8 a.m. is crazy, Ma. 10 a.m. Okay, no, let her come over by 9 a.m. You know how old people like to move fast. Four nights. Um, Okay. Ma gonna be here for about four days. So, um, where you, where, where he at? Ooh, come on, mouse. Don't start with me. We not beefing. Come on, we not beefing. What a, what a man at? Ooh, look at him, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> so this is a non-toxic black family. Unfortunately, if you don't like that, I'm sorry, but this is a non-toxic black family. Like, she love him. He love her. I don't really think they got no beef for real. Look, he was dead. He didn't even know she had a baby in the stomach. <laughs> no way. No way. Wait, I want to share it with the real, the way that they be sharing it with the thing, though. Like the whole shebang. I guess not. Well, complain about your back pain. He missed half of this because he wanted to be dead. So. Wait. I thought you wanted the pregnancy. You said you was chilling. Ma, ain't nobody going to no romance festival with your ass. Receiving affection. I thought she wanted to be pregnant. Why Why I say that? Oh, my baby up there spitting? Hell no. Invite him to feel the baby. He got to get the shower. I love playing with these little infants, though. I must say, they are so adorable. All right, what does baby need, though? To go to bed? Please leave him alone. He's ready to go to bed. Thank you. Give your wife a kiss because you've been dead for a minute. <laughs> Let me stop saying that to him. That's the baby. <laughs> That's the baby's due date. Um, we'll give her a belly hug. Well, no, because I'm going to take a picture. Nope, because I want to take a picture. I want to take a screenshot, so nope. Because you need to come up here and take a shower because you smell. You must smell. I'm, which room was supposed to be their bedroom? Because why they don't have a bathroom in it? See, this house. Mm -mm. 
I should have looked at this house before I, before I, before I picked it because this is stupid. This is dumb. We might delete this and just make this the daggone. Yeah, we might delete this and just make this the bathroom. I don't know what this is going to be because this just don't. Oh, a little tiny office. Mm hmm. Because this just don't make no sense. How is this supposed to be the master bedroom and it ain't got no bathroom attached to it? What? Like, what? Make that make sense. Take a shower, baby, because this don't make no sense around here. I don't know what's going on in this dumb house. I ain't been in here in a minute. Well, I ain't really been in here since I made them. Oh, I'm glad you don't think my llama jokes are getting old. Oh, baby, they been old. But I'm just going to keep acting like they not. Mm-hmm. Yep, you go out there and, and do that. What you doing, baby? Mm-mm. It's 6 o'clock. What dinner? Girl, I can't navigate this house to save my life. <laughs> I'm over here like, damn, boy. Here, cook. Um, oh, well, you and your husband can cook together when he get done. Cook together with Lawson. Make some baked salmon. Oh, no, baked veggies. Because mm, y'all said y'all was on a health kick. Sounds good to me. Mm -hmm. Oh, he ain't clean still? Okay, well. It don't matter, I guess. Now, when they supposed to be cooking together, it's it's literally like them just standing there talking to them the whole time. Like, what what is going on? Why do they do that? The baby yelling? Little baby, what's wrong? What, sir, put the baby to bed. Just get put to bed by your daddy because I'm tired of this motherfucker. And fire this man. Oh, wait, are you still down there cooking with your wife? Oh, he actually cooking with her for real. Oh, shit. Okay, I'm going to leave him alone. Normally, my Sims don't be cooking for real. Okay, Lawson, go ahead. Wait, that's that, that's the wrong person. No, I'm sorry. Get, get put to bed by Colin. Not your daddy. Oh, look, the mama said, fuck that. I'm getting my baby. And you better fire him, because she don't play them games by her child. Wait, you still cook? Oh, okay, you just can't... Okay. This is too much. Why, why my Sims want to do everything? Come on, y'all. Y'all fucking with the story. Put the baby in the damn crib so he can go to bed, please. Because why y'all doing that? <laughs> Alright, go to bed. Try to go night-night. Okay. Where had little heels on? Oh, they really cooking together for once. My sales don't never do this. Oh, wow. Wait, what's going on? Oh. What you making aside? He put, you putting all the veggies together because all y'all doing is making veggies. I don't know why it's taking so long. Y'all really tripping. Damn, bro. It's you dying to laughter for me. It really is. Oh, hurry up, girl, because you got to pee. What a dog food thing at? Okay, here. Uh, fill this up for the dog. And the food is done, but you have to pee, ma'am. Where's the bathroom? Oh, right here. Okay. I gotta learn this house, y'all. Girl, why did you put this all the way over here? And I just realized, oh, I about to say they ain't got no dining room. What's that there? What's over here? Oh, oh, can't nothing go on y'all table? Wait a minute, baby. Oh, okay. I'm like, wait a minute. And then, uh, call to the meal. Or grab a servant together. Are y'all in the group? Oh, okay. I ain't know. Why you not peeing? Baby. Baby, you all right? She stuck? You. <sighs> of course my sim decides to piss on herself after I told her funky ass to go to the damn bathroom. Of course. Don't piss on yourself, bro. Just go use the restroom. Come on, because I don't have time to play with you. I told you to go to the bathroom. Mm -hmm. And come on now, because your husband want to eat, damn it. Y'all both need to go ahead and eat. Y'all got work in the morning? No, okay. Oh, yeah, tomorrow's Sunday. Your mama coming over. You right. I'm tripping. I'm all up in there. I'm, I'm bothering her. My bad, my bad, my bad. How can they not be happy? Wait. 
He don't want this baby. Wait. He don't want the baby. He like, dang, we already got one. He don't want that baby. They finna sit down and eat and talk about this. Wow. Wow, I didn't know he didn't want the baby. That's why she asked her mama to come with her to the birth. No way, y'all. This is their first drama. Oh, I love this. I thought this was going to be a nice, happy family, but apparently not. Apparently not. Apparently they just like, mm -mm. is he the daddy? That's a good question. I hope he is, though. I would only hope because he's been dead. So now I got to see. <laughs> Now I got to see for real, y'all. Wait. No, we got to know. Wait, is he the daddy? I still didn't see you. I I'm assuming he the daddy of this baby. I'm assuming, y'all. But I want him to... If he could talk to her about it or something, that would be cool. We should do that. Oh, well, not romance. Uh, pregnancy and family. Not bemoan about not having used the birth control. Um, offer massage for pregnancy. Call. Oh, wow. Maybe he don't want it, but he'll be nice to her about it. Maybe he won't be a dick, you know? Because he still love her, but he really don't want that baby, y'all. This is not funny. Custody and alternative. Oh my god, this is a lot. It's hopelessness about future with baby. No, that's crazy. Share worries about the pregnancy. I mean, I don't know what you're worried for. Y'all got four hundred thousand dollars. You'll be fine. You gonna ask her about the pregnancy? Okay, she said the same thing she said to her mom. She in the third trimester. Like, look, okay, I'm just a little worried about us having another one so soon. Like, the baby is still a baby. Like, you know? Tell them it's gonna be all right. They'll figure it out. And then my mom's coming tomorrow. And, when, you know, she's gonna help out for as long as she can. Oh, yeah, try to reassure him about the pregnancy. Damn, man. I didn't know he was getting down like that, y'all. Why you acting like that? Mm -hmm. she's like it's gonna be okay okay like my mom's gonna come by and she says she's gonna help out with the baby for a couple days and stuff and you know man, it'll be fine we'll figure it out this man tired of this bland dad i feel like never mind y'all this might not be a, a nice household he don't want the baby he might cheat because he eating all this healthy food <laughs> <laughs> this man like i want a burger <laughs> like i can see him sneaking and, and eating burgers and shit you know like i could see that i could see him like come like going out to eat or something real quick before he go home type shit <laughs> that's crazy i can't never just have a happy wholesome family well that's that's a lot i do have a happy wholesome family they don't cheat they don't do nothing so that's that's fine it don't be me, man. It be the Sims. I don't care what nobody say. It be the Sims. They do it to themselves. They do it to themselves. Because him not being happy about this baby was not planned. Just tell her you love her and go upstairs and get in the shower and get ready to go to bed. Cause, well, I guess you ain't sleepy. But just go ahead and go upstairs and get in the shower. Because you take a thoughtful shower. He got to think about his, what's going on right now. He's confused. Oh, she said, do you love me? Or are you just saying that? She got to make sure because... Now you fucking with her and this baby. Make him sleep in the other room, girl. Come in here. Is she she mad now. Oh, wait. Did you give him a kiss? Oh, she over here flirting with him. Girl, go to bed. Bye. All right, I'm gonna go get in the shower. Okay, I'm gonna go to bed. I'm really tired. I've been working today. I went to go see mom. Oh. Girl, he don't want your baby, girl. I don't want no man that don't want my baby. Just saying. How you not gonna want my baby? Oh, she got a little robe on. Oh, man, y'all. He don't want that baby. Why well, ain't getting no lotion? She ain't got no lotion. Oh, shit. Good, good. 
He going down the stairs to go watch TV. Here, watch, watch, uh, watch channel. Mm-hmm. Watch the sports channel. I normally have the mod in by Alexis Ariel with all the black TV shows and movies and, I mean, the TV shows and, um, like, TV channels and stuff. But, um, I took it out because I was playing with non-black Sims and I was like, do they really be watching this shit for real? Nah, I don't think so, so. Why this couch so fucking close to this damn thing? Can you even sit? Why is this so close? Who did that? I'm really starting to hate this build. Like, the more and more I'm looking at it, I'm just like... If I play with this family enough, I will decorate this house. Because this shit is fucking ugly. Like, I would tear down some of this stuff. Like, just... Like, I like the way it looks like it's giving rich. It's giving money, right? From the outside, it's giving money. It's giving they built this home for them to live here. Like, it definitely doesn't look like it belongs in this world only because it looks like they just built this home for them. And that's kind of what I wanted it to look like. Like, they they built this here in Oasis Springs. They wanted to live here. Over here are influencers. This is like an influencer house. I'll play with them one day. But that's the influencer house that live over there. They got a talent agent that lives in there with them. And they're just a bunch. It's teenagers and young adults that live in there. And they all just create content. You know, like the hype house and stuff. You know, when influencers and streamer, streamers live together and shit. Yeah, that's what they do over there. He down there watching the game. Oh, um, dismiss this man, please. Love that. Yeah, I, I really thought that would be cool. And pretty much every world has a set of, like, influencers or whatever. Because I just feel like influencers are everywhere. YouTubers and streamers and stuff are everywhere. We just don't see them every day. Or we don't know that we're looking at them every day. Like, I literally recently found out that a girl that one of my best friends, my best friend, that she watched, a girl on YouTube that be uh, vlogging and shit, she actually lived across the street from one of our old friends. And he don't live that far from us. I was like... Look at that. I didn't even know she lived right there. But apparently she did a video and you kind of like see her house or whatever, I guess. But that was literally her house. I was like, what? That's crazy. You know, it is a small world. It is. You done watching TV, baby? You still not sleepy, though. Like, you good? He really stressing about this baby, y'all. He not. He don't like this. Is this supposed to be their wine cellar? <gasps> I got that little wine thing from um, QMBB. I need to put that in here so they can buy their wine. Oh, that'd be cute. Mm -hmm. See, yeah, that house could really be something. It really can. But I'm going to wait till after she plopped this baby out. Because when you having this baby, girl, how long you been in your third trimester? So I'm waiting. Patiently. Not patiently. She got a craving for something healthy, but she just ate something healthy. How can they not be happy? Her partner reacted poorly to the news. It's devastating. Sierra is so happy about this baby, but her partner does not want it. Damn. Well, maybe tomorrow she can go to like her OBGYN appointment and stuff because I haven't been here to do this with her. So maybe we can quickly go get the ultrasound and all that done tomorrow. That way we can feel like we was a part of her journey. But I did not know this bitch was pregnant. Oh, this man came in here and started reading. He's trying to get his mind off of this shit for real. What kind of practice piano? Why not? Since you ain't sleepy, that baby talk got him up. Oh, and I need you to schedule a maid. I know they're not going to... Ooh, y'all, wait a minute. Oh, Lord, hold on. Oh, the baby up. Here, come up here with your baby. Oh, he likes piano. Okay, we're going to get you to learn some then. Oh, get a baby a teeth and tablet. He's not doing too well. Perfection. Kiss your baby. Ugh, that baby always spitting somewhere. Activities. Uh, bounce the baby. What does it need? What does he need? Oh, he needs to eat. Okay. And then let's go ahead and 
feed him a bottle. Oh, no, no, no. I want to actually get the little panda Sama thing for the baby bottle. Because I seen somebody do that animation. I was like, oh, my God. <laughs> like, I was so happy. So, wait a minute. Let me, let me. Oh, y'all hear this song? Wait a minute. That's a good little song. Hold on. He killing it. Okay. That came up faster than I thought it was, y'all. Um, Panda. I don't know if it's going to come up but if, by me typing Panda Samuel. But um, if you got a lot of CC like me, you know every time you pull up your Bill Bob thing and you type something, it's going to take forever. So let that brew. Let that brew. While that's brewing, give me a second, y'all. Let me get up and stretch and, 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 and get it together. Yeah, you know, them. You know. See, yeah, let me get up and stretch and shit while that's doing that. Y'all, give me a second. <laughs> Cool beans, cool beans. We got what we got. Okay. You need to go downstairs and make the baby a bottle. Little man, what you doing? Did he put him on the floor? I'm done. Roll over. Okay, little baby, don't cry. Take a teeth and tap. I don't know what to tell you. Um, little baby, you gonna be okay. You can't even roll over. Oh, look at the dog. Smile at Apollo. Watch him. Mm hmm. Oh, don't be crying. Look, your daddy making you a bottle. Did he make it? He did. He better go feed him. You better go feed your baby. I sell the milk to the milk bank. Where's the baby? Girl, I can't remember where this damn house is. I hope he about to feed him. Uh, feed him formula milk. Is that what you're about to do? You should be. Uh, you picked him up to put him down? Are you special? Get that baby back up. What's your name? Lawson. Okay, we got Lawson and Sierra. Okay. Oh, that baby is too cute. I kid y'all not. This baby. Now, this is pride and joy. I ain't gonna lie. He was happy about this baby, but he's so cute. This baby is adorable. Oh my God. Cuddle the baby when you finish. Low mm -hmm. raspberry. What else you got going on with your bookie? You about to use his diaper. Oh, I should have put a little changing table in here. I forgot. I don't feel like opening that thing again. I really don't. Oh, call your y'all babies. What is he? He's a Capricorn. Oh, he might get along with her mom. He hasn't met her mom at all. Like since they got married and all of that like she didn't t she really hasn't been informing her mom about her life at all she's a zig writer <laughs> that's why she pregnant nasty oh it's good night go back to bed baby oh my lord the baby is just crying Okay, she got, she's peeing. And brush your teeth when you finish, since you already up. Oh, I said when you finish. Oh, you didn't, oh, you didn't take that as when you finish. She took that as right now. No, no, leave that baby alone. You do what you doing. Thank you, Buki. And then I'm gonna have her open up her phone and go ahead and set the way I want her pregnancy to be. I don't want her to fuck around and get pregnant. I mean, uh, what are you doing? Didn't I tell you to go pee? Girl, piss. This is why you be pissing on yourself. What's your husband doing? Why everybody keep trying to check on this baby? What's wrong with you? Nothing is wrong with you. Go to bed. Why can't the baby go to bed? 
Is it because he's teething? No, I don't know what the fuck is wrong with him. Oh my god. What is wrong with this child? Put this damn child to bed. You still ain't went to pee? Girl, you about to get on my nerves. You ain't doing nothing I'm telling you to do. Home birth. Choose this option. She gonna let her mama accompany her to the birth only because the daddy didn't even want. Well, he gonna be here. So. He don't even want the baby, so we'll see. Your mama coming today, though. She should be here soon. What's she supposed to do? Um. Oh, she gotta go to the. Oh my god. This is this is one of the reasons why these these babies be stressing me out sometimes. Um. Change the baby diaper, please. Do not put him in that. Cri then I just tell her not to put him in that crib. Oh, the doggy sleeping by the baby's side. That's so cute. Y'all be... Okay, now put the baby to sleep. Okay, okay. Okay, mama is sorry. I'm trying to put you to bed. Please put him in the bed. Please stop holding him. Do he still stink? Or is that her? Who stink? Why would he still stink? Oh boy. Kiss the baby goodnight, please. Please go to bed, little baby. Please go to bed. Just go to bed. Just go to bed. night night. Don't. Oh, I was about to say, don't fuck with him. Oh, he came over here to kiss her. Oh, all right. Well, good morning, Dan. Sexy. She got to go to some appointments this morning before her mom come. That little motherfucker is just, ugh. He just crying. He's cute, but he's just crying. All right. Pregnancy checkups. Let's go. Um, He can't go because he needs to... need to watch the baby no let's let him go he don't want the baby though nah he ain't going he already don't want the baby let him live <laughs> let him live you just go by yourself and get your little checkup get your little ass checkup because <laughs> he do not want that baby y'all he just don't that's in my way i just need some dick i just need some love I done fucking with these lame niggas, baby. I just uh, want to be the fuck, baby. One, baby. Ain't shade, baby. I'm gonna need more than a hug. Girls can't never say they want it. Girls can't never say how. Girls can't never say they need it. Girls can't never say now. Oh, shit. This the guy I was talking about that that um that married that Asian that Blasian girl. This is him, Angelo. He is a doctor. They both were doctors, but I guess she just wanted to be a housewife. I mean, I, not a housewife, but I guess she just wanted to be a mom. She just she just really enjoys being a mom. That's what I'm assuming at this point. She just really enjoys being a mom. BB dot enable rebuild. Now we can get some shit done. Let's get an ultrasound first. Ultrasound preference. What's that? I don't know, but all right, I'll figure that out. But let's go get your ultrasound. Where you at, big belly? All them doctors I put in here, and y'all motherfuckers came up out of all the doctors I put. That just made me mad. I have doctors, like NPC doctors in here. Come on, girl. Get your little ultrasound. What does it say? Has learned that Angelo is a surgeon. Oh, Well, no shit. He delivered his wife's baby, though. Their last, the baby that, that's before the one she pregnant with now. She deli He delivered that baby. He sure did. 
You're pregnant based on the ultrasound. It looks like you're expecting one healthy baby. Everything looks good so far, but we'll continue to monitor your pregnancy and the baby's development to make sure it stays on track. This is an exciting time, and we're here to support every step of the way. And she's having a girl. Ah. I love a good chocolate girl. Well, black girl. Yeah, she's going to be so cute. I know it. I know it. Sierra's cute. She's going to be cute. Yes, girl. Your little baby. Oh, okay. Let me help her out. You're having a baby. Oh, that's so cute. This mod is so fucking cute. Go ahead and get you a pap test while you actually know we gotta go home. Your mama's coming. Yeah, fuck the pap test. She'll be fine. That was cute though. Uh, are you ready to start? Uh, this will end the current. Yeah, okay. That's fine. We was going home anyway, girl. I knew they was gonna do that. Look how pregnant self in his heels. She's still wearing these heels. I think I only made one outfit for her, so she's just gonna be like that until I make her another one. I don't got time. I want her to have this baby so bad. Like, I want her to have it tonight. <laughs> I don't want to wait. I don't want to wait. Or I don't want to have it off camera. Like, I kind of want to have it while we on the stream. By the way, all of these uh, streams for this LP or these couple of LPs or whatever, they're going to be up on my YouTube channel next week. I'm going to start posting them next week. So oh, look at her little everyday. I mean, her little hot weather. Oh, your mama, though. <laughs> Why your mama does like that? Wait a minute. Let's fix Let's fix Miss Bertha. Y'all see her church fit? A mess. I'm a, uh, whatever this outfit is, I'm going to make this a hot weather outfit, I guess. Until I give her one, because I damn sure didn't give her one. Happy outfit. Nice. Hot weather. Paste outfit. All right. Welcome your mom to your humble abode. I was like, what that $32 was for? Girl, welcome your damn mama. Hey, mama. How you doing? I'm ready for this baby to get up out of me. I know you are, girl. I know you are. Introduce your mama to Brandon, to the baby. I wish we could move her a little. I wish we could move her suitcase. Yeah, two of my coming through. Two of my coming through. Because we most definitely... Oh, shit, y'all. I clicked on some meals. I'm still learning the two of my... Don't, don't, don't yell at me. I was talking shit in my ass. Okay. Oh, put the rug back. Uh-uh, wait a minute. Okay, I'm going to just put her suitcase up here if I can. This. I didn't... Wait, what's going on? Oh, uh, cool. Okay, there we go. Move, <laughs> two of mom coming through. Introduce your mom to the baby. I don't know why that mailbox right there, but whatever. So like, come on in, mama. Mm -hmm. Get that baby. Why the baby stink? You gonna hand your mama a stink ass baby? She gonna be like, baby, why this baby stink? I was like, attractiveness alert. That's your husband, of course. Oh, they both attracted to each other. That's so cute. She's like, this is uh, Brandon. My baby, baby. She's like, oh, my grandson. <laughs> I got to control her. Oh, my God. This is so cute. She gets to meet her grandson. Oh, I can't be her because she's doing a stay over. Fuck. It's cool. It's cool. We just gonna let mama ride. I mean, oh, you gotta introduce your mama to your husband too, girl. Um, we gotta we can ask about another sim. Is that what it's called? 
We can ask her to help out and relax. Oh, that's cute. Wait, um, how we ask about another sim so we can get her to walk over there to him? Actually, I'm just gonna have him come over here and introduce himself to her. Do a friendly introduction to Miss Bertha. Oh, a cheerful one. Yeah, yeah. Stop eating. Miss Bertha going. Miss Bertha going grill. It seemed like a nice day today. Miss Bertha might grill. Wait, it's a grill back here, ain't it? We can have a cute little pool day. Oh, this is gonna be so cute. Oh man, hold on, y'all. One second. I don't know about to die. I left my game running, y'all. This is crazy. Wait a minute. Let me make sure everything's okay. He over here kissing. Who gonna wash this baby though? Look, look, Miss Bertha over here smoking a cigarette. Like, mm. Mm hmm. Come watch this damn baby, y'all. Y'all stop playing with this child. Wake this baby up. This baby still didn't go to bed? Oh my, y'all know. I don't know what's going on. Let it swing my way. I just need something. I just need some love. I done fucking with these lame niggas, baby. Get that baby a bath. No, we not in the mood to be doing all that. Here, get a baby a bath so your your wife can uh talk to your mama. Oh, she got a pee. She got oh, she just peed on herself. Her mama like, oh baby, go. It's okay. It's okay. Go on, but go do what you need to do. She got a shower now. Jesus Christ. She gonna take a shower. She in love with this baby. Oh, I can't wait till she have it. Yeah. Flirty vibes, okay. Yeah, girl, please shower. Yep, mm hmm he giving the baby a bath. Good, good, everybody's winning. Somebody gotta make a bottle, though. I ain't gonna lie to you. Somebody gotta make a bottle. Mm-mm. Oh, look at that baby. He's so cute. I'm like, ma'am, are you in there showering? Because it's not showing that you're showering. Mm -hmm. Girls can't never say how. Please stop putting this baby on this damn floor like that. Now they look like her fucking suitcase floating. I'm done, bro. <laughs> they, <laughs> they keep putting this baby on this floor like this. This baby needs to eat, though. Y'all really need to, uh, somebody need to make a bottle. Okay, come down, come make a bottle. Handle this baby situation. <gasps> She's in labor! Oh, her mama came just in time, y'all. She's literally in the shower in labor. Yes! I just knew this was gonna make it longer. Okay, wait, okay. Wait, okay, how do I call the... Lil Baby, shut up. I'm trying to figure out how I call the people so I, so I can get some help around here. We're over here yelling. Be quiet, Lil Baby. Is it in the socials? I did it last time. How you call your doctor? You need some? Wait, how you call the people? So they can come help you with the baby? Or do you click on her? Look, now I gotta figure it out, y'all. Oh, okay, start home birth. Is your booby leaking too? Oh, that's contractions. I was about to say, come on now. I know your titty ain't leaking too. This is just too much. Okay, okay. Now we could call, call them right. Prepare for home birth by purchasing a birth pool. Activities such as the breathing exercise, taking a bath, or exercise. Please stop. Or exercising on the birth ball will help manage. Okay. Then we supposed to call the doctor over here, or or is that how we start the birth? Oh yeah, call the midwife. Mm-hmm. Call this midwife. She hungry. It's a lot going on. The dog in the baby face. She's sleepy. It's too much going on, girl. 
Hey, here, order you, order you some food or something, because this is just becoming too much. <laughs> it's too much going on, y'all. She about to have a baby. Oh my gosh. Um, food shop delivery. Yeah, we're just gonna order some meals real quick. Somebody please get that baby off the floor. Everybody hungry. This is too much. He going to sleep. This is too much. Food shop delivery. Let's get a chicken bowl. Let's get... Well, hold on. Wait. They got sushi, y'all. Now, let's just get some meals. We got a chicken bowl. Um... Let's get our man a potato bowl. And then let's get some cake. I gotta have some cake. She gotta have some cake. Let's get her some chocolate cake. And then her husband can have like a strawberry cake. Sounds good to me. Uh -huh. Order her some food. This baby is starving. We have to feed this baby before we get our baby taken away. This is not funny no more. Do you got the bottle in your inventory? Good. Give it to the mama, cause she even in labor, she gonna get his baby this bottle. Wake up, little baby. I know you tired, but you gotta wake up, little baby. Hey, mama, I'm pregnant, like real pregnant, about to have this baby pregnant. Okay, feed the baby. Who the baby shitting on the cell? Oh, I am the baby. I'm like, what's going on? <laughs> yeah, feed the baby formula milk, and then we gonna let you live. We are gonna let you live. What your husband needs to eat. It's too many things going on. You still down there grabbing, bro? That's why I want to control the mama so that she can, um, like, help. Um, can we tell her to help out again? Like, give me that option. Ask Bertha to help out. Ma'am, can you help us out a little bit? We struggling just a little bit. Sure can, baby. Look, he freaking out and shit. Look at this doctor. Look at her fucking mouth, bro. There's no way. Girl, I know you ain't smooching your man while you got this baby in your hand like this. Uh-uh, y'all is doing too much. Y'all is doing too much. Put this damn baby down. They in there smooching in each other's face and shit. Here, put Brandon down. Put him to sleep. One or the other. No one was around, so we left your delivery on your lot. Oh, thank you. Husband, please go get that. Where you left it at? Oh, I, my door locked, ain't it? Sure is. My gate locked. Here, come down here and open this delivery. What's your problem, little man? Just go to bed. Try to go night night. There you go. Your mama, your mama needs to uh get herself together. Look at look at this lady smoking in the house. We would yell at her, but we we stress right now. So just exercise. <laughs> just exercise that away, girl. Wait. Oh, it's groceries into the fridge. Oh, that's smart. That is so smart. It's a lot going on with this baby they got and, and, and them trying to have this situation. He ate, so he should be good. But I'm going to give her her chicken bowl. Mm -hmm. And as soon as you're done bouncing, baby, you can eat your chicken bowl. But we got to change this outfit. You cannot be bouncing in heels and all of this other extra stuff. Let's put your sleepwear on. Not the box. Wait, baby, wait. <laughs> Not get more alcohol for the past five days. Would you check on me? Hey, did you look for me? I walked in the room. I read. Don't smoke bonga. Don't you check for me? Did you look for me? Hey, all right. Let her bounce around a little bit. Now her husband gonna come here and help her out in a second. I'm gonna just let her do what she do first. Okay, yeah, please go pee, cause my Sims tend tend to be piecing on themselves. All right, 
get him together a little bit. I know you tired. I know she tired. He tired. Oh, that bitch passed out. She can't. It's too much going on. She's hungry. The pain. Wait, Buki. Eat your chicken bowl at least. Eat your chicken bowl. I know you got a piss. Here, sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Eat your chicken bowl, please. Everything gonna be okay. Oh, she got a little ultrasound picture. She is tired. Look, he going to bed. He not even worried about her. It's so much going on. The mama just got here and nobody's paying the mama no attention. I really thought we was going to have like one more day before we had the baby, but whatever. Let me find out. Mama talking to the doctor like, when you going to go check her dilation? Because she's in a lot of pain. Ma'am, I got it. I'm going to do this. I can't talk for her with her mouth like that. Hmm. That chicken bowl good, Buki? Oh, Lord. Look, your mama came up here to make sure you was okay. She like, baby, you okay? Wait, who you told died? Oh, girl, you playing too much. What's going on? She making her daughter laugh or something? My like, mama, this hurt. This too much. She like, baby, you already did it once. You gonna be all right. And you didn't have me last time. Hey, sway with your mama. Damn, bitch. I'm just fucking her all the way up. She keep pissing on herself, y'all. Shit. Take a shower. Damn, girl. I'm sorry. I'm just not there for you. Don't pass out. Come on. I got you. She going through a lot. Oh, Lord. I'm so sorry. <laughs> y'all, she tired. She tired. Just go to sleep. Just go to sleep after you take a shower. Just take a breather. Take a minute, because your husband needs to go to bed, too. I don't know what's going on, y'all. This is too much. All right, yeah, go to bed, please. Just go to bed. No, 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 do not pass out. Why are you passing out? Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Come on. Come on. Get it together. Take your ass in there and go to bed, I said. Just go lay down. Just go lay down. Come on. Oh, you can't go to bed in there or something? Damn! She getting on my nerves. Come on and go to bed. Boy, have mercy, y'all. She is not making it. I might have to cheat a little bit. She's not making it. <laughs> She ain't gonna never get to the pregnancy. I mean, to having the baby. Because she can't, she can't get it together, y'all. She hungry. She sleepy. Somebody help with this baby. There we go, Grandma. Come through, Grandma. Please, Grandma. Get fed by Miss Bertha. She changed the diaper. Mm-hmm. Come on, Miss Bertha. Smile at Miss Bertha. That's your grandma. Look at that. You got to meet your grandma and tell her to feed you while she at it. Because I don't know where your dad at and what he doing, but he damn sure ain't helping with the goddamn nothing down there asleep. We're gonna, I want him to get up and go up there and sway with her and shit. Like, she got to get get this baby out. We not about to keep playing. Did you, you finish your food? Oh, boy. Every time I turn around, she got another need. She hungry. I'm trying to get her to get this baby out. I'm trying to see how dilated she is. Here, eat the potato bowl too, girl, because you just got a lot going on. Eat the potato bowl. You got to pee again? Damn. Okay, don't eat the potato bowl. Piss. <laughs> There's no way this is happening to me where she got all of these needs. She want to be friendly to her mama. What's wrong, baby? Oh, he ready to go back to bed? Okay. And then get put to bed by Miss Bertha. What are you doing? You need to come in here and make sure your wife is okay. Please. Okay, stop eating. Go pee. Yeah, just put it down. Just, just go pee. And we'll put it in that inventory so she can eat it later. Ask for a back massage from your husband when you get done pissing. Oh. 
All right, go. Uh-uh. Class your husband for a back massage. Try to go night night, little man. Is he already doing that? Okay. Yes, please help your wife. She's having a serious situation. And she hairy. No way. <laughs> she like, ooh, this feel good. That's gonna be okay, sweetheart. We're gonna get through this. He gonna have to go to counseling for not wanting that baby, and that's gonna be real sad. Sway together. Sway with me. Come on, you don't have time to freak out right now. Sway with me. Thank you. Oh, oh, hello. I want to take a screenshot. Oh, they at least trying. He at least trying. He's at least trying. He was he was sh shitty for a second. I don't know what was going on, but you finish eating your potato bowl, and then we are gonna figure out the dilation. Um. Oh, what a what a uh doctor. There she go. She ain't over the other bed. Yeah. When we get done eating, we're going to ask for that. Oh, okay. I guess she's going to ask now. Can you check my dilation, please? Okay, I guess she'll eat when she's done. When you're done. Wait, you going to check it right here on the couch? You going to get all up in my coochie on the couch? I guess so, y'all. She's going to get right up in the coochie on the couch. Are we dilated enough? It did give me the option to have my baby, I think, though. I can see, whoa, I can see the baby's head. You are fully dilated. If you would do a water birth now, it would be a good time to get in the birth pool. <gasps> oh, she's fully dilated. Miss <laughs> mm. Bertha, you better come in here. Well, I don't think she want to be in there. She just want to be here. Yeah, maybe she don't want to be in there. Come in there, hubby. It's time for the baby. Wait, we doing this in the pool? Oh, I was about to say, wait a minute. <laughs> wait, what are you doing? Girl, get your ass up here and have this fucking baby. What are you doing? I know you hungry. Look, I'm gonna fix it. I'm gonna fix it. I'm gonna fix everything. I'm gonna fix everything. Just go up there and have this baby. Please. Are you, are you not going up there to have this baby? Oh, I'm, I'm about to say, come on, come on, come on. What is this? Yuck, from secondhand smoke. Oh, Lord, from your mama smoking. Oh, you got it. You got it. Where the, where the doctor? Hello? Uh-uh, the doctor ain't even helping. I guess she's just going to do this by herself. Whatever. It, it is what it is. Oh, you got it, girl. You got it. He like, it's okay. We got this. It's going to be okay. Like, oh, this is hurting so bad. Oh, Lord, Sierra. Oh, is it coming out? Oh, Sierra. She had to get up on her knees. Oh, Sierra. You got it, boo. Oh, Lord. You got it. I'm believing you. Is it coming out? Oh, she's crying. Oh, oh, it's coming out. It's coming out. Oh, it's a girl. Okay, what should we name her? Ooh, I don't know. Oh, I'm about to look up some black baby girl names. <clears throat> I don't care. Black baby girl names. Black girl names. Mm -hmm. This is how I be coming up with names for my Sims. <laughs> I just be typing that in. Whatever kind of name I'm looking for. Jasmine? Wait, her, another, her brother's name is Brandon. Oh, what if we name her Brianna? She, they're not twins, girl. They are not twins. Mm, Mia. Mia. What about Mia? Naomi? Naomi. Naomi. I like Naomi Foster. I got you. Mia. Oh my goodness. Oh, I know you can't see it though. Damn. The baby. Oh, look at it. We can't really see it because she's still naked. Oh my gosh. 
You did it, girl. You did it. Oh, I know you can barely see, but this is cute anyway. He still love her though. He'll go to canceling about the baby. He just he just didn't want it right now. Oh, they got the I ain't got no bed for this baby. No bassinet, no nothing. Oh, he gave it to the daddy. Oh, look at this motherfucker's head though. Damn. Damn. The head is crazy. Oh. This is cute. Oh. She should go back to the obstetrician in a couple days to a postpartum checkup. Okay. Oh, she ain't got no pants on, y'all. Okay, we'll go to the bathroom, boo. Since she gotta go so bad. Girl, get out of here. Girl, go. I know you nine. I know, I know he. I know he ain't. Okay. Did the doctor leave? Please go. You're done. Should I have clicked her to have the baby? No, we're not doing that right now. Uh, when you get done, dismiss her. Ooh, and it was right on time too, y'all. Yeah, okay. Well, thank you guys so much for coming out to the stream. I had a lot of fun today. Um, I appreciate y'all for coming. That's all I really can say. Can you